Get ready for the laughs, the drama, and the unbelievable moments that made this year unforgettable. It's the best of Karen's and Kevin's for 2023. Danny DeVito's grandfather has a problem with these landscapers' work methods. Wrong. You did it wrong. And if I have to call somebody to get him out here to finish this job, I will. You want to... You know what? Replace it three I'm blowing you up online today. Here's how he deals with his clients. Here's how he deals with it. Brings the whole crew, whines all day long about how he's losing money, and he's busting up a pad that they did wrong. They did it wrong. Here they all are. These are the guys you want to watch out for. They did it wrong. They did it wrong. They did it wrong. They did it wrong, and now they're busting it up, and I'm calling the police right now. Calling the police. All done. Calling the police. Get ready to explain yourself. Karen is so paranoid that this person is stalking her that she actually gives them information about where she lives. No, I'm not kidding. I'm waiting for somebody, for a tenant. Well, I've given instructions to the management company mm -hmm. that I don't want okay. anything changed on my air conditioner or my heater. I'm not here for your apartment. Good. I'm in apartment 221. Okay. It's on the first floor above the ground floor, even though it says 221. Okay. And I've made that very clear to police and to other authorities. Okay. Have a good day. Stop stalking USA English speaking people. USA? Yes, United States of America. Okay. I was born and raised here too. I'm not stalking you, sir. I'm You're not... stalking me. I, like I said, I'm waiting for a tenant. I don't believe you. Yo, <laughs> my first 2023 carrot, bro. <laughs> I'm waiting for a tenant. She, she in the, she on the. I feel the most for the poor dogs here. They clearly had to go out and use the restroom. I wonder if Karen found that out the hard way when she got back up to her room. I don't have to tell you why you're I'm being, here. You're being recorded Bye, Karen. Out there, so say hello. This guy's being a rude jerk and he shouldn't be allowed in here anymore. Bye, Karen. Yeah. It's your man looking at us all somewhere. You look real professional. I know. Yeah. You look real great. You look beautiful. You look just like your dog. You're an immature, unprofessional jerk. And you're a Karen. No, I live here. Okay. And when you're in here... I don't have to tell you why I'm here, lady. Because I live here. Hey, lady, go on on about your business, man. Because I live here and you don't. You and your twins, go on on about your business. Oh. You know what? We're sorry. Karen, do what you got to do. I'm going to go to security guard. Bye. 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 I'm going to go to security Bye, Karen. Bye, Karen. It's your racist. She repeats, keep your hands to yourself when this guy was nowhere near touching her. Is she okay? I don't, don't care. Throw no. your phone over here. I will throw my phone over there you because this is sitting here and I'm trying No, to you sleep. were sitting over so there. Stop throwing your phone you were over sitting here. over the other side. This is not yours. This is not yours. This Listen, is not your space. You're being a it's not your space. You're being a fan. You're being a Karen. You're being, stupid. You're being a Karen. You're being stupid and ignorant. You want that okay? Keep it up, this see is what not happens. Your space. This is not yours. See what happens. Keep your hands away from my body. Keep your hands over there. That's not your Keep space. Keep your hands to I am your not self. You. I am not Keep your you. hands to your self. Keep your hands the over there. This is not your space. Are you so a I'm man? Gonna, and am put, I a female? I don't, Keep your hands gonna, over there. I'm gonna put there. my, my, my Keep phone your over there. I don't give a 
What you talking about? You Keep case. your f hands on your f side. Keep your f hands to yourself. Don't put your f hands over here. I don't give a f what you trying to do. You got the right because I'm not scared of you. Neither am I scared of you. Well, you're going to get arrested soon okay. because you're in the wrong. You try. Keep your f hands you over try. there. You try. Keep your Same as you, you have just have to mind your own business. No, I am just no, no, you just have to mind your hands near me. I am just putting my don't phone put over there. Don't put your hands near putting me. putting my phone don't, over there. I don't give a f about your phone. Don't I'm put your hands over there. I'm just putting my over phone here. over there. Don't put your hands over there. Because you over don't here own near this near space. You're a f***ing You're a f***ing idiot. Don't put your hands over there. You learned in second grade to keep your f***ing hands to yourself. Aren't you an adult? Dummy. Something must be wrong with you mentally. You must have a mental problem. You gotta have a mental problem. You're behaving like somebody that's either on drugs or got a mental problem. So which one is it? It's one or the other. Because there's no reason to do that. I've charged my phone many times without disturbing nobody. Do not I don't own care this. what you do over there, but don't put your hands near You do not near own me. this space. Don't put your hands near me. Sorry, don't go to public. Don't put your hands near don't me. Go to public transportation if you can't me. share your little space. Don't put your hands near me. I ask you to stop. It seems like this one could have been resolved much more easily than it was. This, oh my God. this lady just got in my car, opened my car, pictures of my car, I didn't even know, I didn't say nothing, I just said excuse me, I just said excuse me and she keeps screaming, I asked for a manager, this person shouldn't be working here because she is very disrespectful, I didn't even say open the, I didn't even see nothing, my door, my back door, I didn't even see, I was on Facebook, I didn't even see her. No, she kept going. I didn't even say sh to her. Get the manager here. I'm calling the cops on this. I'm calling the cops on her. She's being real, really. I nope. I'm not. I'm taking video of her and I will post this sh so they can see the nasty sh they do here. Get me the manager right now. I'm calling the cops on her because I didn't do nothing on her. I didn't do nothing on her. She touched my vehicle without no permission. She is being loud, disrespectful. Yeah, that one right there. That one right there. Look at the customer service they have in this place. Car rental, look. Look at the customer service they have in this place. No manager, nobody. Oh, and she hit the car. It's time for a classic game here on Fantastic Freakouts. It's Karen versus Kevin, round one. Who will win? We just come come up to somebody's window and just You're tell them to turn off the car. And there's a baby sleeping in there. This is a public driveway. I understand. You're t you 
can totally do what you want, but I'm just asking you because your exhaust is going right in our window and there's a baby sleeping in there. And I told you we're leaving and, and I told, do you know what I, idling laws are? It's okay with you? Do you know what idling I laws are? Three minutes. Three minutes. We've yeah. been here for one but minute. There's, but there's the minute of the law and then there's like common courtesy. We're neighbors. Uh, no, common courtesy I'm just is you come up neighbors. to me after three minutes. How do you feel about this? this no, no, no. Common courtesy is you come up to me after three minutes. He's asking, it's just for a baby. Okay. Seat. You can do what you want. You're very powerful, I, big man. No, I'm I told you we'll be gone in a couple of minutes. But why is your engine still running? Because we've been here for one minute. But why is why do you need it running? I don't care about your feelings. But I care about the about law. Feelings. It's about the health. law. It's the law is three minutes. It's called health and safety. For okay, a baby. I'm done talking to you. Have a nice day, ma'am. Turn off your engine. Hopefully, you have a better day. That's so. I'm gonna ask him to go. Be better. Be better. Be better. Uh, can you please leave uh, uh, this side? You're uh, causing danger right now. It's dangerous to stand right in the middle of the street. Car struggle. I'm just asking you a favor. Uh, can you go on that side, I'm please? Just asking you a favor. Can you not stand in the middle of the street please while? Don't turn. I live here. Please turn off your engine. Can you please uh, get out of the street? So you just want to distract from like? I just want you, you to get out of the street. I understand. So you want. I can leave. I also want things. No, I'm not going to be able to leave when you're standing right oh, there. Well, please. No, no not until you leave the uh, middle of the street. Not. You can't be in the middle of the street, man. No, you cannot. This is illegal. You cannot stand in the middle of the street when the cars are going and coming. Well, thank you for your concern. All right. Safety. I'm glad you care more about me than a little baby. You, clearly, you don't care about care your about health right and other people's health because really you're standing in the middle of the street. It's not about my... I'm asking you politely. You asked me to leave, okay. and I'm asking you politely ask to leave. leave. I said stay as long as you want. That's how I opened the conversation. You're totally welcome to stay. Okay. I'm glad that you're staying here and enjoying your conversation. I just uh, would ask you to just turn off your engine while you're doing it. I will do that if you leave the middle of the street. You want to make it a power struggle? No, no, no. It's I will do that. It's, it's compromise. It's, it's compromise. For a little baby. No, it's right. compromise. I, I can clearly <laughs> see that the sooner I leave this conversation, the exactly. you feel like you're not being forced to do Exactly. Right? Thank you. That's really important I appreciate to you right that. now. Your personal power over a little. No, no. No, 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 no. You're mistaken. Bye, Karen. I'm not white. So don't call me Karen. But you, it's not about being white. It's about your actions. Lady, the elevator has been stuck for 90 minutes. How hard is it to press three numbers on the phone and say something? And you guys refuse to call the fire department because you want to say Monday. Is that the case? The procedure is for the security on site to do that, but I've let them know about about how you're feeling. I've also let them know I'm... about the ETA, and they did tell me that there is no ETA at the moment. I can't give you something I do not have. Yeah, but call the fire department. It's emergency. Yes, of course, but as well, the fire department will also wait on the technicians as well, uh, even if they are on site. I've already let the security guard know that you guys requested the dispatch for the ambulance and the fire department, but... You're not calling it because it costs $10,000 to get fire department here. It's a way to save money on, on our suffering, so thank you. But I also need to keep the lines clear. Unless there is an emergency in the elevator, we have a woman that's about to pass out. Well, it's not emergency. This is one of those situations where the person recording is a bigger Karen than the ones they're filming. Use the bathroom and we have it recorded. So, uh, yeah. yeah. She's, the the business business yeah. Owner. She's the owner of the business. And she pays the rent and, every month. And you pay rent. rent for I don't pay rent for anything. I work here. Exactly. exactly. Okay. Exactly. You two have no right to get aggressive with my girl. I'm not getting aggressive what with anybody. Calm down. Calm down. Tone it down. Tone it down, ma'am. Okay. Yeah, yes, Stop you did. did. You did. I you did. Going on no, you said what the F. F okay. You did. Right. You did. Right. Yeah, see? Just like that. Just like that. Can I ask you a simple question? question? You don't have to ask I us nothing. Go talk to your landlord. I did talk to my yeah, landlord. Yeah, and what happened? Today. Nothing was said to us, so. Okay, yeah. listen to me for a second. I don't have to listen to nothing you're saying. I want to know I don't why have to listen to anything. in your building. Because I want to use it here. Yeah, why? Why? Because we want to. But you don't pay rent here. So? This is not your building. It's not your bathroom. So? Talk to your manager so? about improving the bathroom I'm gonna still use if it. you don't like it. I'm still going to use it. Well, we'll, take well it okay. Then we'll, we'll just take, take it up it. with the landlord. Go we'll for it. it. We'll and go it. for it. And we'll seek we'll a reduction in our rent uh -huh. because we can't use our own freaking bathroom. First of all, I don't even know who else is in those other stalls. Howdy. Who else is in those stalls? I have no idea. Your people. They, 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 they camped out and there's probably somebody from the building. Okay. 
they are waving at our receptionist and saying hi. So they're antagonizing. Oh, I did not do anything. Oh, I said hi. I was being pleasant. I was being pleasant. And I said hi. I did not wave or do I did. I wave. Me. I wave. And I can and I will and I'll do it every time I walk in here. Yeah. Okay. okay. Right. You guys think you have a right to this bathroom? We will go over there. And go for it. Take liberties in your in your building. Hey, enjoy yourself. Go ahead. And we'll be very loud in the freaking lobby. Like That's okay. being loud here in this. You're being loud. No. She came in loud. here yelling, saying the f word. So. Okay, the yeah. Exactly. Exactly. And what's wrong with that? And. And. What the. We're here. Are you all 18 and years old? Is there somebody in that, that install or did you all lock it from no, the inside? Okay, bye. No more screaming, screams the Karen. We're violent. Your age was the better with you. I just got here. Okay. Anyone screaming, go on the couch and the restaurant is all up. You got it? What? You're at a proper age. Hey, guys, keep your friends under control. No more screaming. Now, you know what's happening? Not here, not now. <laughs> Learn to deal with things. I will call the cops. Okay. <laughs> no <laughs> screaming. Hey, keep yourself under control. Keep your friends under control. Got it? Understood. Have a great day. Love your hoodie. Bye. <laughs> okay. I'll bite. What's the full story here? So... You are absolutely nobody. You're a piece of. You're. You're nothing. You can leave. Okay. Yeah. I got you on you, camera. That's fine. Get Just out. Sit, sleep in. That's fine. Horn Lake. You, this is how they treat their diamond Lake. members. Instagram famous. That's another term for influencer, right? Hey, have you ever noticed how the word influencer sounds really close to the word influenza? Pure coincidence, I'm sure. Call me a again. Yeah, you guys did nothing wrong. I said, shut up. No, you shut the up. You shut the up in here. Hey, Film me. I'm Instagram famous, you bum. Shut the up. Could I see your receipt, please? Interesting how easy that was to say. Now check out how this worker, Karen, fails this basic task. I'll pay for all my items and she's come chase me down last night she can check. That's not a problem. No, I've already got you. You've just said you're a store detective. You need to check. Yeah, so checking. check. What do you need to check for? We've not been here now. We've not abused you. Just to you, check. It's not mine. It's tough to check what you have. That's fine. Well, yeah, it is. If I take my items at the tilling, you're chasing me down trying to tell me that I haven't paid for certain things. I've paid for everything. Nobody said you haven't paid for certain things. You used to scan as a thief. So, uh, so yeah, I did a scan as your shop. Can I have your name, please? Since you're going through my shopping and you're saying you're a store detective, but you've got no ID and you've showed me no ID. Yeah, I'm recording. I am recording. You just chased me down the aisle after I, I paid for my shoulders. Been asked to come and speak to you. He's just told me he's a store detective. Stop recording. No, I cannot stop Do recording. Sign the police. That's not a problem. I've paid for all my items. So I am entitled no, to record. Yes, I can record you. You're just trying to accuse me. Just you, you not her. Where is she? She just chased me down well, and come and snatched me. Recording me. Yeah, right, I am recording you because you've I'm come over person. and you've started to. You've I've started literally to... just been asked to come and just check that that's paid for. I check, see, you've paid for. I've just paid for my items. Just call the police. <laughs> Off my phone. Oh. Who are you grabbing my stuff no, out of my hand? No, you cannot take my property out of my hand. You can't you record were... it. Yes, I can record you. If you're trying to cause a scene, no one will. Calm down, I'll pay for my shopping. You're trying to stop me from leaving here. I'm not trying to yeah. stop you. You've just grabbed my trolley and told me you need to go through it. And then try grabbing my phone out of my hand because I'm recording you. Okay. I've already got your face up, there's no problem. And I'm getting you done for a soul as well because you just tried grabbing my phone. I will get you done for a soul because I will point at you after you just tried grabbing my phone out of my hand, you silly cow. 
Somebody needs to revisit the job overview because this is not how drop-offs work. Was this person justified in going full mama bear here? Leave your thoughts below. About who dropped my five-year-old off? Who dropped my five-year-old off? So I could cross the road Come on. by herself on, near a pond. She was missing for over an hour. Come on. And y'all refusing to help me? Yeah, you're, you're refusing to help me. You rest the record. No dead about to be everywhere. What's it move? Every where? Move! Get off me! I can't even record this What is it with Karen's having adorable little dogs that don't deserve to be put in these situations? Don't you? Don't you hit me! Don't you hit me! Don't My you child is in like the car! Go away from me! I don't care! You are, go away! This is a go away. neighborhood! That doesn't- I'm an Instacart! I'm Instacart! I don't care what you are! Get that out of my face! I'm going- Do not! Get in the car! I have you on camera! I don't care! Get away from me! I don't me. care! Get away from Get me! Get in the car! Don't tell me what to do! You're not my mother! A private neighborhood! You have no- I right am that. Instacart! Who cares? I am Instacart! Who cares? You just scratched my face! Good. Get out of my face. No. Get out of my face, ma'am. You ma slow down in this. I don't give a. F you. Gonna, I don't give a. You're, what are you gonna do? I'm gonna call Instacart. Go ahead. What's your license plate? Go ahead. Four and I'm gonna. Four, guess guess three, what? Three, I have this. I have four, this video four, of you trying to grab my phone three, out of my hand, three, and you, three, and you four, trying one, to catch. Four, you trying. Three, I don't care. V. I, I don't care. I'm calling you scratched them. my face. Look at my face, bro. Good. You scratched my face. You tried to take my hand, Good. my phone out of my hand. For what? For what? I'm speeding on a private road. I am on Instacart. Doesn't matter. I'm literally going 15 miles an hour. No, you weren't. You were going at least 25. Okay. When you came down the road, you it were going It doesn't matter. I am Instacart. So why are you saying- That doesn't give you the right to It doesn't the give law. you the right to stand in front of my car and flag me 
fucking down. Yes, it does. No, it doesn't, this ma'am. This is a private neighborhood. It doesn't matter. I'm going to punch you. Go ahead, because I have it on camera. Go ahead. Go ahead. Don't Go ahead. Me. I will take Go you down. Go ahead. You have no you have no reason to be flagging me down in the middle of the road. Yeah, I do. You said you were going to Would threaten. you want somebody driving Go ahead. on your street? I don't care. I don't care. I don't own the road. You threaten me again. What make this nation suck? Really? Yeah. You. Really why? Why? Why is that? Because you have no respect. I have no None. respect. All right, Karen, None. go ahead, Karen. Go Karen. Get in your car. Go Karen. Don't tell me what to do. You're not my mother. You're not my mother. You're not my mother. Don't get get in the car Don't then. tell me. Don't grab me. Get in the car. You're not my mom. Don't you hit Don't me. Don't you touch me. I'm going to call the police. Good. I have Go everything ahead. on camera. Go ahead. Everything on I camera. Done and I'm going to Yes, you did. You just slapped me. You I have it on first. No, I didn't. Yes, you you tried to grab my hand. I you no, try to grab my no, phone out of my hand. Me. You try to grab my phone you out of my hand. Me. I'm not escalating. No you are. BCV. Go ahead, and I will. I will submit this to whoever you do. Whoever. You don't know Jack. I don't know Jack. Lady, get in your house. You don't even know where my house is. Right there. Yeah. Walk. Go ahead. You stupid. Who the f do you think you are? Who the f do you think you are? Threatening me, you weird. Get in your car. Get go. Go in your house. Thinking that you own the damn road. You don't own this road. It's public. I'm trying to say it's private. Ten miles an hour. I don't give a. F I am in the car. I'm going to report. I'm going to report you to the f police because you tried to attack me. Has anyone ever stopped speaking another language around someone else because a person who didn't speak the language aggressively yelled at them not to? And, and this person just heard me speak Spanish, and she said, great, you're Mexican, right? Repeat what you just said. You have a problem with people that speak Spanish in your country, right? Yeah, because it's Repeat America. what you just said. It's America. What did you just say to me? You don't speak Spanish What did America. you just say to me? If what did you say to me? Country. He, speak clearly what you said to me. Do you live in a child? Let me know what you said. Here. You're, you're racist. It's not I'm speaking it. children. It's not I have a child and I speak Spanish to my child. And you have a problem with that? I told you. You have a problem with that, I right? what I just said. I'm you have a problem with it. I can speak Spanish to whoever I want to. We're free to speak Spanish wherever the heck we want. You are no one to tell me that this is your country. You're no one to tell me to speak what language because I know what I want to speak. And it's not my fault that you're not bilingual and obviously because you don't I'm know American Spanish. And I'm white and is that a problem to you? What I speak in? Is that a problem to you? It's a problem to you to you both that I speak Spanish? That's a problem to you, right? It's a it's offensive that you use that bathroom when she's in a wheelchair. No. Like, your comment your comment was racist and it had nothing to do with using the restroom. I hate Mexicans, it's true. Awesome. They're awesome. 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 You are really telling the wrong person that. Regardless of me having a child or not, I'm at least showing my son boundaries that he can speak whatever language he wants also. So don't think that because I have a child, I'm not going to stand up for him or me. Being handicapped has nothing to do with being racist. Thank you. Yeah, both of these people have a problem with me speaking Spanish to my son. You have a problem, you have a problem with it, right? You have a problem with it? Yeah, you're, you're telling that to a person with a whole bunch of Mexicans here, you have no problem with that, right? He says, I'm not going anywhere. And the no-fly list he ended up on agrees with him. Uh, you guys need to come out right now. You guys need to come out or we're going to have to deplane the entire plane and you guys are going to come out here right now. Okay. Oh.
Can anyone decipher what incited this incident here? Going out to eat on Friday night goes wrong. That's what it is? Let me know. Y'all can't talk? What's up? Nobody ain't got nothing to say. Other than you, that I'm embarrassing y'all. What's up? Is we sisters or we not? What's up? Y'all sit here eating with this boy. Look, I love Pokemon as much as the next guy, but gotta catch them all is a catchy slogan, not a life motto. Child's meal. I'll take a refund, sir. You're certainly behaving like one. You don't have a book. You don't have a book or Pokemon cards? You gave me a donkey, two kids' meals in a row because I'm an adult. I came here as a child. I wanted a child's nostalgia meal. If I can't have it, I want a refund. This is McDonald's Canada. McDonald's Canada shouldn't treat customers like this. He says he has no books or Pokemon cards left in stock with a whole rack of them. He gives me a donkey two times in a row. McDonald's, I want to press charges on McDonald's. You're behaving I'm worse sorry. than my disabled children, I'll no, tell you that. $6. I do not. I want my six I want my donation back too. I know I'm not being worse than a sick child. I want yes, you are. Too. Put it online. Put it online. I'm being targeted. Oh, I will if you want. I do. I want. wasn't going to, Please but I will. Please put it online. I'll continue yeah. because I'm being targeted. Why can I not get a child meal? No, with you're good. No, you're no, okay. You, you don't have it. No, I don't have you it. don't have a book or chip or Pokemon cards. I wish them to come to Truro, Nova Scotia, Canada, McDonald's, and say they don't have a book or Pokemon cards in the building. This isn't right, sir. Are you the manager? I wish to speak to the manager. I want to complain. Mm -hmm. I'm sober and I'm a wise, wise man. I want to make nod on that receipt. You can scan that one. You can scan it. Are yeah, I have a cell phone. Yeah, you can scan it. You can go online. You can scan it. I'm making a scene because you're being that. No, sir. What yes, I sir, you are. I really don't have a year in the This is the only one I have. I don't believe you. Are you lying to me on Sunday, on God's day? Are you lying to me, sir, on Sunday, on God's day? Is I are you, sir? Look me in the eyes and says you're I'm telling you, by the way. You're definitely saying you're telling the truth. I don't have anything. No, man, I need my money back. Excuse you. I'm dealing with this manager here. Maybe he can get you on this patch. No, 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 no. We're on camera. No, no, no. You came into my zone. Do that will not use a Do it. Honey, back up. I'll press charges, dude. I don't care if you press charges. Okay, then do it, bro. I'm saying do it. You said you'd do it. Please leave, sir. Problem. You are now. Do it. Do it, dude. Who are you? Yeah, right. Meet you outside. All right, let's go. I'll meet you. Let's find it out. Yeah, okay. Look at you. How big are your ankles? Size small? I'm like a cornered dog, buddy. Like, I'd like your nose off. Cut! 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 You're going to get cut! Face, oh, do it! Do it! I have no words for this. Just take a look. This is not my neighborhood? No, it's not your neighborhood. I haven't lived here for 10 plus years. It doesn't matter. I didn't go to the University of Miami matter. and live here in Camille. Okay. You don't have a brain. You got scholarship because that's what you got. This is how you went to the university. What does that mean? Because your brain. No, I paid, I paid the money. <laughs> I didn't get a scholarship to UM. Trust me. My parents have money, that's why we live here. People have money too.
pay. People have money too. You did not pay. Don't tell me that you pay. You want to see my student loans? I can I can bring up Mohila right now. Is there any reason people purposely go out of their way to get a homeless person's sleeping bag wet? I can't think of one, but apparently this guy can. So what? You're covering his sleeping bag. That's wrong. You know that. What are you doing? I don't give a about that. That is out of order. Bang out of order. That is bang out of order. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Hey, yo. Why are you that trouble, man? Why no, you wouldn't be why he's trouble. He's just covered his sleeping bag in water. It's like winter. No, mate. Don't give me... That's a matter. That is outrageous. One of the most interesting sagas of the year right here. Excuse me? It's not normal to ask to put a lock and key on the door. There's a lock on the bathroom. I'm not moving out tomorrow. I paid my rent. I am here until May 1st. No, you're not. I don't yes, I am. Out. You can't kick me out. Okay, well, you're not. That is literally guests. against the law. Okay. This is my apartment. No. It is my apartment, too. I paid to be here. You are not allowed to have anyone spend the night. No. I don't want to deal with it. I don't want to deal with any more of this. It's already bad with just you right now. And if you're hating it here, well, you know what? I don't hate it here. You make it uncomfortable to live here. It doesn't here. matter. It does matter. It does matter. No, it does no, matter. You said you're moving out May 1st. That's great. Okay. I'm not gonna, I, I am not gonna bend over backwards for anyone that I'm not giving respectful energy, okay? I've so been I very respectful to you. Yes, I, I have. I have been so sponge. respectful here. Everything you do, I ask. I take the trash out. I clean up after myself. I'm quiet. I know you're okay. working. I try to stay out of your way. When you need to get in the bathroom, I leave so you can get into the bathroom. I'm quiet when I come right. home and go. I don't ask anything of you. I don't take up your time. I don't even text you because you don't like texting. I give you your space. I stay out of your way. I'm an incredibly respectful okay, so roommate. And it, I don't affect you. I don't affect you. Yeah. No, you did not. I you did. are lying. Take a f Xanax and chill the hell out. I don't take pills and you're not going to have guests ever. This girl knows her rights down to a T. It's out of the question. So if you want to move out, do it. You will not be able to have something. I never allow guests ever. There is a no guest policy. We talked about this before. We did not talk about Yes, this. we did. Well, I'm sorry you misunderstood. We can talk about this later no, no. when you've calmed I, down. I am I am busy. I know my tenant rights. I took a course at school about property management and tenant laws. I know my rights. I know the laws. You're renting if you a room. I am yes, and the shared apartment is a shared apartment space. If you do anything to touch my stuff, move my things, change the locks, or kick me out before m May first, I will come against you with the full extent of the law. You're not. There is a no guest policy. What do you, you don't have a no guest policy. We do not have a written agreement, and we discussed. No, this didn't. before I moved in. When? We absolutely did. We sat on the couch and I said, before I make any commitment to move in, I want to know how you feel about me having friends or no. a partner or my sister coming to visit. No? And then you came around to it. You were like, mm, I don't have people over. I, I'm not in, in favor of it. What do you not understand? You told me your sister's coming from out of the country. Absolutely. She's coming from Oregon. Well, She's not what? coming from out of the country. She can spend the day here. You can make breakfast, but no overnight guests. Okay? No overnight guests. It's, it's not up to you. It is not up to you. This was talked about before you moved. Yes, it absolutely was talked about. And we came to an agreement. You're like, oh yeah, we'll go and watch this out. I had all, oh, my cousins and my nieces and nephews come and stay. Okay. No, Remember you I don't get to treat me like this. I'm not treating you like you're, this. You are threatening me and you're treating me like Threatening you. Saying you're gonna have the locks changed? Are you, you kidding me? And her sass don't quit either. You're gonna have the locks changed? Are you, you kidding me? anyone spend the night? There is no one allowed I'm not bringing night. over random hookups or randoms off the street or people you don't you know. This in, is my sister. You're in your room 24-7. I'm not in my room. You are. I go out. I do things. I go work. I hang out with people. I live a life. You're in your room 24-7. Okay, you know what? I really don't appreciate your attitude right now. <laughs> my I'm, attitude. Yeah. You're hilarious. You should be a comedian. Okay, thank you for that. So where we're at now, you're welcome to move out before, even today, tomorrow. No, nope, May 1st. Then I don't know what you do not understand. There's no overnight gas at all. I don't have gas. I could if I want, but there's no overnight gas. This was talked about before you moved in. You agreed. No. Nope. Nope. 
No, I did not agree. I did not agree to that. We talked about this. No, we didn't. I kindly asked your courtesy. I was like, hey, my sister's coming into town to visit. She wants, you know, okay. stay here. You were all like, oh yeah, we'll pull the air mattress out. Like, what are you saying? Oh, we never talked about this. Yes, we absolutely did. And we have text messages. No, 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 no. Okay? So we're not going to talk about this again. If we don't need to. If you do not want to abide by what we agreed before. We did not agree to that. We did not agree to that. We do not have a written that, agreement. This is not a flop house. This is not for you to bring someone to stay in. I the never place. bring people over. I don't have people coming in that I'm okay. hooking up with or friends or parties. This obviously is not a good No, it is not. Because you're so controlling. You're so controlling. Okay, well, you know what? This is where it's at. It's not a Maybe if she was one night, but no, not six nights. No, no, no. I'm sorry. I'm not going to, I am not going to entertain talking about this anymore. I, she, She's not coming to visit you. It doesn't matter. It's my apartment. It is our apartment. It is our apartment. No, it's not. You're renting a room. I live here. Okay. I live here. This is our apartment until May 1st when I'm gone. No. Listen to the Karen roommate's logic here. It's almost like she knows she's in the wrong and pretends she'd be fine with the hypothetical pose here. Brilliant galaxy brain move, dude. I live here. This is our apartment until May 1st when I'm gone. No, you're renting a No, I apartment. know my rights here as okay. a tenant. So, no guests. There is not a no guest policy. We can talk about this later. I'm not interested in talking with you anymore today you because you're very worked up and so much. You've already done things right now that I don't want to get into, but no, no guess, no guess. Not for a week, no way. Saturday, Friday to Saturday, no way. That is so rude. You can get a hotel. She can stay in Airbnb. This is not a flop house. It's my apartment. I'm not treating this like a flop house. What are you talking about a why flop would house? You ever not even, why would you not, where would it come from you'd want someone, your sister or whomever to stay for a week? Where would that come from? You're renting a room. It's not you and your sister renting a room. You're renting a room. That's what you're doing. You are renting a room. And I can have my sister come visit and stay in my room for a few nights. She can nights. come during the day. She's not spending the night. There are no overnight guests. Okay, so if she can come during the day, would you rather we stay out here and blast music and dance and drink and f*** around in here and then she can go sleep somewhere else? Okay, or would you rather we go out during the day, we're quiet, and she comes and quietly sleeps you, in my you bed? You whatever you want during the day as long as it's respecting my privacy. If you're going to f*** around and allow music, then yeah, I'll say please turn the music down. She can come during the day, but she no overnight guests. There. Why? 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 I, what do you think is going to happen? It's and I right now don't even feel comfortable talking to you. Her patience is immaculate and impeccable. I'm trying to be a cold hearted. It's my apartment. It's our apartment. It's my apartment. I'm on the lease. You're renting a room. And yeah, I'm not trying to be you. a cold hearted. What? From you. Yes. Right. So when you say it's our apartment, you did not pay I a I live fee. here too. You're renting a This room. is my home. This is my home too. While you pay rent, it is yes. for you. Okay? So at the end of the day, it's not our apartment. It's your, you're renting a room. You're a guest in my home. And I'm trying to make you feel comfortable. I shouldn't be like that. Okay, well, you know what? This then, is my home too. I live here too. Then it's not a good fit and you're willing to, you can move out anytime you want. You can can I have a moment apartment. to get a word out? If you can want, I have a moment to get a word out? No, because it's not going anywhere. If you want to get You're your own apartment. You're not letting me talk. Because I gotta get back to work. I'm working. I Wait. should move out tomorrow then, because right now. I'm not gonna move out tomorrow. Okay. I then, thought we were fixing this, not starting I another am, fight. Right. So Let's fix this. I don't want to start another fight. Then you can pay rent for April, and then if you pay rent, possibly your sister, because I do not want, it. If you're going to move out May 1st, okay, because right now it's getting me, and you wanted to put a lock and key on the door. Yes, because I feel like my space has been disrespected. Okay. Keep in mind, this is over a lock on the door. I have never, ever, in my life, in my life, wherever I've lived, in any home that I've owned, in any, growing up, no one has ever had a key and a lock on a door. And I've never not had a key and a lock on my door. Well, then you should have checked it before you moved in. So I... I don't even think it's good for you to stay at all. I don't feel comfortable. I, I have... It's it doesn't matter. I don't have anywhere to go. This is where not, I live. That's not my concern, okay? It doesn't... Well, I live here. I paid rent, and I have rights as a then, tenant. Then pay rent for April, and you can say, well, why would you... Why would... Where would it come... Why would you... I just disagree with you. Okay, well then you know what? And I'm trying to find a solution, but instead this you keep shutting me down and you won't let me talk I and you keep talking over me. You don't let me get any words out. I have to work. This is my work day. It's a full 12 hour day for me. So I'm, 
Like seriously, it's the outcome is not a good outcome. You act like I don't have things going on in my life too. Okay. I'm I understand you work. I understand I'm you work. I'm working right now. I'm supposed to be doing an interview with a new client. Good. I'm trying to solve this. Why are okay. you freaking out? Because it's taking me time away from my work. I have to tell my company I had an emergency that I took a half hour off. So what is it you want to say? Just go back to work. No, no. Nothing I'm... productive is going to come out of this conversation no, when it, you're so gonna... worked up. If the film she made is anywhere near as gripping as this saga, I think she's got a bright future ahead of her. Because of our fight yesterday, that was a lot. And I don't think that we've been very successful as roommates together. Then, then it's not a good fit for you. I get that. It's not a It's good not fit. a good fit for you either. Okay, that's not, you can't tell me what's a good fit for So you me. like having me here? I'm trying to make it work for both of us so we can both be happy. How long do you want to live here? You're making me want to leave. Uh, you are making me want to okay, leave. Yeah. Don't you want the person living in this apartment to want to be here? It's not, that, Don't you want them to feel comfortable and want to live here and like you and like living here? What my question Because is. you you don't make that enjoyable. I, you I, know I, nothing oh, about me. Wish you well. That's what you it's know like, nothing about what me. Is your I have been now? living here for so long. You've never asked me a thing about myself. You you haven't asked me where I grow up, what I went to school for, who okay, my friends are, what I do. You know nothing about me. And okay. now you're trying to interrogate me and all these things. You. What is I'm wrong with you? I'm concerned about your mental state. I am I'm concerned. concerned about your mental state. Well, thank you. Holy you, cow. You basically are doing or did a documentary about taking your own life. It's not about taking my own life. It is a fictional film that I made because I'm a filmmaker and filmmakers make films about stories that are what's, written. What's this story about? It's none of your damn business. I, it was sent to me. It's about bullying and depression. Okay. I said that. Are you depressed? No, I'm not depressed. Why are you in your room for two or three days in a row? I'm not in my room for two or three days in a row. I, I've been gone a lot. Okay, I've been I, gone a ton. See, you're even upset that I'm just living here. As, you don't want a roommate. You're upset as, that I'm living here. As your movie, I think the title is I Wish You Well, okay? <laughs> I wish you horribly. This guy wears his racism as proudly as he wears his badge. You are trash. Okay. Okay. All right. Keep talking. I will. Okay. With me, you classic. What you gotta do? I, I tell you what. You have I'm a stupid yeah, I'm a stupid she is a stupid. He hit my plate. I'm a stupid. Fix your car. And stop honking at people when you don't need Such to. A this dude is making it rain. Soda, that is. Do it. Do it. Take a I'm taking a video. Go, you goddamn piece of sh you kicking it. I'm pregnant. What the f I'm gonna I'll do? Go walk up. Get the f out of here. Do you do something. Do f you. What happened here? People think they're going to jail. Ain't nobody going to jail tonight. They're going to jail. 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 they are going to jail 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 they are Sir, 
He's not going to jail, bro. He did it in self defense. Coffee is probably one of the worst things to get yelled at about because it's something that people are cranky about until they have it the way they like it. Evidence, this video. Here, I got a gift card. Okay, I just want to show you. Yeah. This is, and I'm videotaping this because it's disgusting. Yeah. Literally, yeah, so. straight chocolate. Like, that's, you yeah, can see it, it's disgusting. That's you not a milk cup. Chocolate? Like, really, it's stuck at the bottom of the cup. You don't see that? Yeah, that's what you want. You didn't want mocha in it? A mocha cappuccino is not that. Okay. Is it a fra you want a frappuccino? No. I wanted a mocha cappuccino. I do want a frappuccino now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I, yeah, yeah. I know I can it taste is. that right right while I'm here and yeah. not have to worry about yeah. it. Yeah. I got you. Here's your gift. This is a $10 gift card. For us. And then, what do you want? A mocha frappuccino? Uh, yeah. Okay. Then I want my money back. So is this $10 for my experience and my gas or? Yeah. And this is okay. Really, I'm gonna refund you for the drink here. You do realize I've probably spent an hour right now. I know. I'm very sorry. Right. You seem really sorry. Alright, this is gonna put the money back onto your card. Do you have your Starbucks card? I paid cash. Oh, you paid cash? Okay. Okay, and your name? Okay, and I am going to be contacting corporate because this is the worst experience I've ever had in my life. Okay, sorry. We'll get you, you everything don't... you need. Oh, baby. We're making your frappuccino. It's coming right out. Do you just want like a grande mocha frappuccino? What is a grande? I want medium. You want a medium? Medium. Sorry. They're all laughing. You see this? Apparently, I think this is funny. Oh my god, that doesn't look right either. That doesn't look anything like it. Like that—that that literally says chip on it. Did you want a frappuccino? That says Java chip on it. Are you guys kidding? Are you guys kidding? Oh my god. They're not even embarrassed. How are they not embarrassed of themselves? Well, she should lose her job. Take a picture of the last one. It wasn't until this year that I found out people get mad enough about posters to tear them down. These are innocent civilians in Israel. You what? You These are our I just gotta know. Where is security in all this? I don't want to be no, nobody who's on the ass. And I get a better video right here, Ashley. So I <laughs> 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 Look how white, white feet are, you guys. Look how white my feet are compared to that dirty, nasty, fat Latino in the corner who wants to take her shoes off. And they get funny. Oh, silence. Well, I knew it. Mom. No, mom is, right? No, mom is. When I take my shoes off, it's great. Yeah. We'll see you, fat. Can't find his way out of a wet paper bag. We'll see you. Mm -hmm. 
my Stand God. up. Let me see how much you weigh. Same amount as that in the corner, right? Over 200. Got an ounce of muscle to you. Ain't nothing to you. Is it really a good idea to yell at the people in a restaurant making your food? I don't say any Korean people over there eat out. I'm okay. Just the Mexicans. This guy blows. Leaves, that is. From blowing leaves to blowing smoke. Check it out. Direction one more time, and we're gonna have a personal problem. You can count. Look, looks like there's one already. No, there is one already, and if you weren't so, you do something about it. Okay? Like but instead, you, you blow your. There, blew my yard you blow your onto everybody. I didn't blow it on. No, anybody. you know what? The county can come and they can talk to that neighbor, that neighbor, anybody. that neighbor, that neighbor, that neighbor. I didn't blow you it on blow anybody. it onto everybody. No, I didn't. Yes, you I do. I just blew it right yeah, out you of the do. bicycle. You're a lying sucker. I just blew it yes, out you of did. the bicycle. Yeah, all totally clean. I've never once have I cr I don't line, give a sh gone over to you your yard over and here blown it your right hyper powered goddamn blower that that by the way is way over the DB limit for the county. I use it once you know or what? twice a year. You know what? Fine. I have the means to take care of it. Okay. I'm not gonna put. I'm not gonna put up with it. I, I, I never, see you blow one I more never, goddamn leaf. I never direction, once. His direction. His direction. I we're never all once. coming for you. I never once. Then goddamn blow the shit into your own corner and pick it up, and put it in a trash can. I never once blew it into. Your I worked as a student teacher for a time, and I've dealt with kids less of a nuisance than this, Kevin. You're out there, mine. It's not yours. Go seat. away. That's not gonna. I happen. pay my money. I have a right. To Do it. sit in your seat, correct? Yes, that's my not, seat. That's not your seat. How can you tell us that my seat? Because your ticket has your seat number on it. Whatever. Let's find it. Whatever. This can easily Do be your own policy. No, you're, you're no, arguing. I'm going to be an because you're being an asshole. I am not. I'm a patron here. Okay, and I'm trying to find your seat. And this will seat. be the last time that I come to this imagined theater 
Sounds All right, great. I paid I, my money. Great. Does please, anybody please here come think back. that please this is back. actually uh, a, a thing where it's like, it doesn't matter where you sit. It's not a side seating. It is. Go oh, sit in your own seat. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Please, sir, let's find your seat and we can start. No, the I'm not going to. Then I'm going to ask you to leave. You did, like four or five times. And that's why now we have a disturbance. Because some other people can't just okay. be like, you know what? I could sit right here. Sir, we're not doing this. One anymore. seat off. We're not doing one this. One seat here. off. So if I were to move over one seat, everything would be okay. Sir. Is that what you're saying? You're just Is that what you're saying? Listen. Does that mean? Are you going to listen? All right, go ahead. Be, go ahead. Be okay. my past. Okay. At this point, you are disrupting the show for these fine folks. We're going to ask you to leave. We'll get you a refund, though. I'll be nice and get you a refund. I don't know. I might want to be taken out in handcuffs now. Sir. I paid my money. I don't understand yeah, we'll why it is. If I sit over here, one at, seat, it's okay, and everything is right with the world. But if not, the world stops and everybody gets upset. Sir, let's go. I'll be nice and I'll get you a refund. I want more than just a refund. Okay. Can I get a drink? We'll take care of you <laughs> in the lobby. Fine. <laughs> And then I won't come back. Okay. Ever. Okay. And I'm going to make sure everybody knows about this. Okay. I appreciate that. I capitulate because I don't want to watch the movie now. You ruined it for me. Because of your silly. Okay. I apologize about that. Goodbye, everyone. Enjoy your movie. Headphones aren't that expensive, are they? We can do this all day. And I'll turn it up to 100. The, reaction. the next step is to strategize. Think about a plan to solve the problem. Create a conceptual plan. To calculate delta H reaction from standard enthalpies of formation, subtract the heats of formation of the reactants multiplied by their stoichiometric coefficient from the heats of formation of the products multiplied by their stoichiometric coefficient. Follow the conceptual plan to solve the problem. The standard enthalpies of formation for each reactant and product are shown here. Remember that the standard enthalpy of formation of pure elements in their standard state is zero. Calculate delta H reaction by substituting these values into the equation. Go ahead and try that now. What is delta H reaction? For a driving instructor, his basic etiquette of how to act with other people really leaves a lot to be desired. Secure the calm. Push. God, give me a second. Oh my God, what is this guy doing? Do you mind? Why are you uh, supervising a learner while you're on a live stream with a phone right in front of you, which Do you is mind? actually blocking your view? It's not blocking my you. view. Can you? I'm sorry, can you your, go away? Your, your driver is actually doing something very Can you illegal. go away, please? Your engine's still on, and now How you're is holding it on? our phone device. It's not on. Okay, well, our engine is two not on. Offenses. Two offenses. Your engine is not also, on. Also, on your social media, you've Can you go away? driving around with Can no you go? Tags. Can you go away? You've lost your mind. Can you go away? Act professionally. Can you go away? Act more professionally. Can you go away? And she was kind enough to give us an update on the situation. Hey guys, I just want to speak about the incident that occurred yesterday whilst on a live. Now, me and my pupil were subjected to bullying and harassment whilst on a driving lesson. The matter is under investigation, so I'm not going to be posting the video. But before I get into it, I want to say a massive thank you to everyone that did reach out to see if me and my pupil were okay, because it was quite a scary encounter. So whilst on a driving lesson with my pupil, there's a driving instructor who's following my car and as we've parked up and switched off the engine, he's parked up in front of us and proceeds to come running towards the car with his phone in his hand, quite aggressive, quite angry, comes over to the passenger door side and starts recording me and my pupil in my car. And I'm quite shocked and surprised at this point on what's even going on and why he's doing this. So out of sheer shock, I've just opened the door and asked him what he's doing. And he's now wedged himself in front of my passenger side door. So I'm now unable to shut my door. And he's just making accusations at me. 
And now I've had to take my phone off the mount and face it towards him and that's when he's backed off and I've had to continuously tell him to go away before he's finally gone away but it's because I started recording him that he's actually backed off. Now this whole thing has left me and my people really scared and anxious. Now I don't want to have anybody messaging him on my behalf and trying to defend me so because I don't condone that kind of behaviour as I don't want to be condoning any sort of bullying. I'm just talking about this issue so that I can bring light to the issue so that we can stop these sort of things from happening as it was a really scary encounter. But um, yeah, as I said, the matter is under investigation and I just want to say a really massive thank you as I was really quite scared and I didn't know what to do. But seeing the love and messages from you guys honestly has helped me pull through this. So thank you. This encounter could have taken one minute for her to just move the car. Instead, she spends three minutes bickering. Excuse me? Uh, you're in our parking space. Uh, no, it's my parking space. Yeah, but have you seen how you're parked? We oh, can't no, fit my in. My car's uh, big, so it needs space. Okay, yeah, your car's big, yeah, but like, it's still like, you can't be parking like that, though. You're like in three spaces in one. Yeah, I don't want to hit my door. Okay, but now we can't fit into our space, which we pay for. Uh, my car's more expensive than your car, but I'm sure that you can fit through there. I'm sure you know how to park. Yeah, well, yeah, I know we know how to park, but it doesn't matter if your car is more expensive than our what car, yeah? It's more expensive. Um, do you know how much this is worth? Well, I no, I know, I know, I don't. But, but like, if this gets damaged, do you know how much that's going to cost me? Well, no, I don't. I don't really care, but you're you're in our space, which well, I pay for. It's more than I pay for my parking, too. Yeah, I know you pay for your parking space, but you're inside my parking space. I'm sure that you know how to park in that space. I'm sure there's enough space there for you. I can't park there. What do you mean you can't park there's there? There's no space there. Of course you can. Well, what do you mean? Of course I can. Then, then like we're gonna hit your door. No, we'll hit no, your car. You just get a little bit in here. I mean, I'm, look, I'm sure there's other parking spaces you can park this in. This is our parking. We cannot even park here now. Like, look, just look at it. How are uh, we yeah. gonna fit? How yeah. are we gonna fit? What do you mean? You can just. You know, I need space on either side to get in and out. Well, you know? I don't care. You need to move your car right now, man. We I'm need not... to go. Like, we need to park. I need here. to go. You need to move your car. We're gonna park here, okay? Oh, you can try. Well, yeah, well, yeah, we can try, but then, like, we might hit your car. Well, there's other parking spaces, as I said. Yeah, so then, like, you can go somewhere else to park there. Yeah. So why yeah. don't you go somewhere else? Well, because my car's bigger than your car. Okay, and then it's not... It's... Are you jealous that my car's bigger than your no, car? No, 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 we're, 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 we're not in school now. Oh, yeah, my car's bigger than your car. Yeah, well, mine is, though. Well, yeah, it is bigger than our car, yeah. It's but much better than yours. All right, all right, <laughs> yeah, all right. But there's, there's no excuse for that. I'm just saying, yeah, that, like... Just saying, you know? This kind of car, this kind of size, it needs more space. So okay, so then, so, so then you're saying what you're doing, yeah? Parking like that. Do you even know how to park? I uh, absolutely know how to park. It's just that this car's bigger, takes up a bit more than a parking space. Okay, so you know how to park, yeah? You, you call that good parking? Well, the thing is, I need to get some stuff out on either side. So I need to open the doors wide. Okay. And this is what works for me. Okay. So, 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 so can you see that white line right there? No, I actually can't. What line? Well, yeah, because your wheel is over it. So, no, there's a white line there, yeah. You're blind. Yeah, yeah, there's a white line there. Then, and then that's enough space for me. Look, there's a parking space. Yeah, yeah, but now there's not enough space for me to get into my car space. But as I said, there's other parking spaces. Yeah, so then why have you parked there then? I've explained it to you. I've explained it to you that my car's bigger than your car. Yeah, and what if there's no enough? other parking spaces and this is the only one left and you're taking two? Well, that's not the scenario. There's yeah, what would happen if I was in a wheelchair? Well, then you wouldn't get a side parking because you'd need to get in and out on both sides. Yeah, but then like I could be recently in a wheelchair. Well, you're not, are you? Well, no, I'm not. No. But I'm saying so, that. Well, that, there's no need to have a hypothesis. Yeah, I know, but I'm saying that they're. Hypothesis. Then... Hypothesis. All right, all right, all right, love. But I'm just saying, yeah, like that there defeats the object because anyone could be in a wheelchair. And now you've but then basically. You'd have a wheelchair park you like, basically stopped someone in a wheelchair. wheelchair That's what you've done. Here, like, Can you just move your car? A wheelchair can't even fit there now. Of all the people who deal with Karens regularly, delivery drivers must have it the worst. Here we go. Okay. I'm on speed dial from yesterday. Okay. If you know where the package is, you could definitely retrieve it. No, I cannot. You can. You deliver to the wrong address. You can't f read. I see. You can always put it in the notes to say delivery to the back door. Have a great day. Go get it. You can do that, yep. Go get it. Oh, but if you thought she was done, you got another thing coming. Your job is to deliver the correct address. Okay. So go get it. 
Well, if you have the address listed and actually noted on the yes, package. Six zero one five is right there at the house, moron. Go have a great it. day. That says six zero one three. That back there says six zero one five. Mm. Learn how to f read, you moron. Yep. You have a great day. Yeah. Karen attempts to lie and accuses this person of lying. No, I want, I'll just get your name and I'll talk to my husband because I'm not doing this. My husband's a lawyer. If you want to lie, then we could go down that road because I know the car is never touched. Oh my gosh. Okay, I was inside I the car I was inside and the car I too. felt it move. Okay, well, I guarantee it didn't move, so I don't know what- I you... felt it move. Okay. Mm -hmm. My car is brand new. Mm -hmm. well, so is mine. Well, all I want to do is change insurance all information. Right, just give me your number, please. So, okay, so I just want to let you know, if you don't, if you leave without giving me I'm insurance. Leaving. I'm going okay. into the bakery. Okay. I just asked for your number. I'll give you no, my no, no. number. That's all we so need So the to legal do. thing to do is change insurance okay, well, information. Okay, we'll do whatever. Just write down your and leave me the hell alone. I'm not in the mood. You're lying, and you want to write down your stuff? That's fine. I'll write like down I said, I don't want to argue. Okay, then just go write down the stuff. I got somewhere to be, and I'm not Okay, in the so mood. you're okay with exchanging insurance information? It's called a hit and run if we don't do this. I said I'm writing it down. Okay, okay, okay. Where's your stuff? Okay, I'm getting it right now. Okay. You do your okay. Okay. Time to act a fool at the pool. Obviously. You want to talk to my mom? Yeah. Uh, I yeah. live in room 148. <laughs> No, 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 we finna, we finna talk to my no, mom I'm, real quick. It's room 148. I got, I got, I got a white girl. I got a white mom too. You don't scare me. She got no, business I, I too. You ain't, you, you ain't house. I will get you, I will get you, will get you locked up. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Get, get out of here. Mind your business. We weren't talking to you. You came up in here no, in my face. Really back up. Back across up. the pool. Back oh, she racist. Oh, oh, she racist. Oh, she racist. Yes, you better back the right. on up. Get the right. out my face. What, you got a problem with it? It's called minding your business and you have a nice day at the pool. You wanted me to talk to your mother. That's what no, I was you doing. did. You did. Where's your house? Where do you live? I could talk to your mom. Here she is. Okay. Are Look, she looked just Harvard? like you. Do you live here on Harvard, Mom? You live here on Harvard. Shut your stupid. Room 148. Room 148. Oh, where's it at? It's right up there. Yeah, right up there. Go up there. Yep. So the dog. Yeah, yeah. Go up there right now. Go up there. Touch that phone. Touch that phone. Karen claims her feet don't work that fast, but man, she sure seems to think her hands well. Excuse me? You got an issue you got, man? You got an issue? Excuse me? You got an issue, man, beeping your horn on us? Me? Yeah, you guys weren't going. I wasn't going. My love, my foot doesn't go that fast to get on oh, the Oh, you didn't. Battle. You just stopped. Watch what you say, man. Watch you just stopped in the middle of the camera. road. You just stopped in the middle of the road. Well, yeah, maybe next time you guys should think no, about hitting listen, the gas pedal. Listen, listen, listen. I don't have to listen to you. Listen, the next Thank time you, you. Thank you. What'd you say? You, you heard, heard what I said. said. Do it. Here. You heard what I said. You heard what I said. Do it. Being stupid. What are you? Take the car. What are you gonna do? Oh, and I'm oh, gonna rip it out of here. Oh, I don't give a shit. Get your hands off of me. What are you doing? Hey, hey, next hey, time, get your hands off of me. Get your hands off of me. Hey, next time you guys can hit the gas. Hit the gas next time. Oh no, it's all right. I'm calling the police on you guys. I'm calling the police on you guys. That ain't the right way. That ain't the right way. That ain't the right way. Salad dressing caused this. Salad dressing.
Oh, but we can get even more petty than that. How about food wrappers? So I was starving, so I had to get one quick sandwich from here. And I thought they gave me the wrong sandwich, but conveniently, McDonald's changed their packaging. Wow. What does that resemble? Yeah, so what is this? This one? Yeah, what is this new packaging? It's the uh, McChicken wrapper. But why is it blue and white? I honestly, I don't know. I think you do know. This is in support of Israel. They changed it. They I mean, it was like that actually since a few months ago because we ran out of the regular ones. No, I don't think so. This is obviously in support of Israel. No, I mean, we actually had that for a while, though. I was here two weeks ago and it wasn't like this. I mean, we have had stuff. We also I know. Have the red I know this is not your fault because you're an employee. Yeah. But I think this is disgusting for them to do this. Mm -hmm. And I know you in your heart. You know in your heart that this is clearly what this wrapper is for. But I mean, I don't know. Uh, I'm, I'm explaining it to you. It is. This is what it's for. This is the color of their flag. Mm -hmm. This is clearly what they're doing mm -hmm. and what they're showing to people. And I think it's disgusting. I'm just curious. What's with the new wrapping? The blue yeah, the blue and white. That's the new one. They just changed the wrap. They just changed it. When did we get? When did you guys get these? Uh, maybe like last week. Last week, right? When when he clearly just told me it's been a few months that we got this. This is in support to Palestinian kids. This wrapping, clearly, th this is a big company. They should not be changing the wrapping okay. on the side. Office. Yeah, I know. This is not your fault. I'm not yeah, saying it's your fault. Your I'm no, 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 no. I, I'm not. I'm just really upset. I'm just really upset that I got my order and I got this flag. Yes. For for my wrapping, and I'm sure I'm not the only one who's upset and who's shocked okay. to come to the drive-through and receive this this wrapping. Yes. Um. So I really advise you to go back to your original wrapping, and if they're forcing you to do this. This, yeah, is, this is going to be known. Even if I say something to my boss and my boss is right. in Kenya, it's like... There, there, I, you know I understand. I, mean? I, I totally understand. Yes. I'm, I'm not trying to be rude to you. No, no, no. I'm just really upset. Yeah, yeah. I'm just really I upset that I, see, that I see this. So this, mm -hmm. you're giving me a McChicken sandwich yes. with this wrapping, supporting the kids. And yes. I, I hope you don't feel good about that. No, I'm going to... I mean, I'm I hope. Tell my, I hope. My boss... If there's nothing that there's nothing no one gonna do. This no, is, it is what it is. McDonald's, so. Really? Yes, so. Yeah. Yeah. I really, I really hope somebody says something about yes, this. Yes. Yes. It's, it's not right. Gonna, I'm gonna tell my boss. And I don't want to make a big deal. Yeah. 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 No, it's okay. No, I understand. Okay. I was really shocked when I saw no, that. Yeah. And it really hurt my feelings. Yes, I know. Being I know. that I'm Palestinian. Uh -huh. And even if I'm not Palestinian, yeah. it's still like a big yes, deal. Yes, yes, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's that's right. yes. Yeah, that's atrocious. That's atrocious. Yes. I cannot believe I even seen that. And um, please throw it away. Okay. Thank you. Okay. How does an adult act worse than a child over a roller coaster? So why do you Who do you think is the bigger Karen here? So again, I'm just gonna ask if whoever's handling my sandwich can just change their gloves because I have celiac disease. Yeah. What number was that? You have a gluten-free, right? Yeah, I have celiac disease. Okay, so you're gonna keep waiting. I ordered it online and it yeah, said it'd be ready that. in 15 uh, we, minutes. We understood that after like a certain amount of time, you get that. And like, I get you on like, you're recording me because you honestly feel like you were disrespected. Because I was. You called me and you because said I needed to be patient. When all I asked, fast food all I asked it was, was that you changed your gloves handling my sandwich because I have celiac disease. And we always on. We and always I have an autoimmune dis disorder. This is a McDonald's. But you didn't have to is be rude. Food? You is didn't have to food? order. You didn't have to be nasty Mamas. when I asked you to change your gloves. Mamas. I have some of these. Like now we're not gonna serve you. Like, Where's your manager? No, I need my sandwich. I paid for it. I paid for it. Are you no. going to refund me? Are yeah, you going to refund me? You can leave our store now because we're not going to no. serve No, yes you are. Because now you're acting like a rich brat and it's not... I'm not, not rich, much. number one. And number two... You don't two, care, but you're acting like you deserve like a top like, service. All I and asked like, was you, you for me to change you. your gloves because I have celiac disease. And, and if you have a problem with that, maybe you shouldn't work in fast food. Or at any restaurant whatsoever. You're the problem. You're the problem. You are. I'm Where's your problem. manager? You're Where's your manager? Neither are you with your pink hair. It was never 
The only garbage man I'm seeing is the dude saying some racist nonsense towards some fine working waste managers. You're the reason why all the Californians are coming in because of cowards like you. You can't even speak up for yourself. You I was actually have, I was actually born in California. You don't even have customer service. No, you're a Texas. That's what you are. You too. Texas. Shameful, dishonorable. Be happy with yourselves. You have a good Be day. Be happy with yourselves. You have a good but day. I'll tell you this much though. I'm gonna make sure that you hold my scumbags. You lose this job so you don't have life. I have a CDL. I'm gonna make sure. I will see about your CDL license for unprofessionalism. We're gonna see how this works out for you, okay? Nothing can be done because I haven't done anything to you. But just so you know, you're a coward. You are a shameful piece of shit. coward. Remember that for the rest of your life. That's okay. My my dad's told me that you're a lot. Good, because it's true. I know. You're a coward. Thank you. Just as long as you know. Thank you. You're a coward. You, you have a great day. This honorable piece of shit. Thank you. The only thing worse than a Kevin is a Kevin with a gun. Out there right now. But I just want to show you kind of why we're here. I mean, we pay good. We pay good money to hunt this property. We've been hunting it for years. Do you do you live on this property right here? I I just I just want to talk to you. I'm sorry. You have an AR in front of me. I'm scared. Dude, I'm scared of right now. Okay, well, it's going to be more scary. Are you attacking me? No, sir. No, sir. Me? No, sir. I, I, I'm Drop hunting. Phone. I'm hunting with... Drop your phone. Oh, my God. Drop your phone. Sir, I'm... I'm, I'm, I'm bow hunting. I don't have any guns on me. I'm asking you to move. I'm asking you... Look at me. You're on my property. You got the mother... You're on my property, sir. Okay, I'm... Listen. I'm I've packing up eight years, right now. You've never been here. Listen, can, can I come listen. out there so we can talk? Come on out. Okay. Don't touch. No, 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 no. I'm, I just have to move my chair. Walk over it. Walk over it. Walk okay. over it. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, I don't know who the f*** is on my property. We, listen to me. We leave. Listen to me. That's fine. Listen to me. I don't give a f*** about none of that. You need to move down from here. You're on my property. You need to move down. Okay. I understand. That's all I'm asking. Okay. No harm. I don't know who the f*** I'm just trying to understand the property here. Do you this. live here? Listen to me. I want you to move down from here. Okay. This is the space. Understood. This is the space. Understood. We're having children, and I'm reacting like I'm reacting like I'm reacting like I completely understand. I, I understand. That's where I'm coming from. Okay. The bows are shooting at the end of the flight. Who's shaking? Who's shaking? Who's shaking? I'm asking you just not to be here. Yes, sir. You know what the f want? Just not here. This is the wrong space for that. Okay. That's all I'm saying. The, the only reason we're here. Who's we? Is, is there someone else here on the property? No, no one else is here on the property, but we have four, pe we have four people on this lease okay. who pay for this hunting property. Understood. Um, the reason that we have this blind here is because, according to our Onyx, who shows us the survey lines, this is the property that we're legally allowed to hunt. We have permission from him to access from his property from our cornfield right there. Understood. And the rule is you're allowed to bow hunt within 125 feet of a residential dwelling. Yeah. So, Well, they don't make the laws for me. I got young children here and understood. I'm reacting as a father. So this is not the place for that. Go down behind his mother This is just saying it. I understand the arrangement. But you're in the wrong place for this, my man. This is, this, this is not it. Understood. This is this is not it. No disrespect to you. I understand what you got going on. Just simply saying this is not the space for it. Down 20 feet. Down 20 feet. If you would, please. Okay. If you would. Yeah. That's your cornfield? Yes. Well, not our cornfield, but we lease it for hunting. I understand. Yes, 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 yes. 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 All right, so no problem. I wish you luck. Oh, you okay? But I don't try being. That it just can't be here, my man. Okay. That's I'll, all I'm asking. All right. All right. All right. Can I get your name, sir? No, you can't. Okay. I understand. I just, I, out of, out of respect, if I see you, I want to be able to communicate. You know. I doubt we're going to run into each other again. Okay. All right. Thank you, sir. I was just trying to be polite. I understand you have that. 
I was just trying to be polite. I, I no, didn't no, mean understood, to understood. understood. I, I follow you on that. No, right. no problem. Halloween is supposed to be fun scary, not... Uh, this scary? Don't put it is that why I have a 27-foot quote by Malcolm X on the of my wall? <laughs> This man had triple A insurance, but I give his freak out a uh, triple D minus. Are you sorry for what you did to me? I am sorry that the circumstances. Are you sorry for what you did to me, or are you not? Sir, you canceled my 26 year membership. You did that. Well, then who did it? For what reason? You were the only one that interacted with, and you admitted failure, failure, failure. Good job. Good job. Recording it. Nice. Why not? Absolutely. He just, he wants entertainment, so... He wants entertainment. You hurt me, and you sadly have to take that to your grave. I choose to forgive you for the hurt and cause of all the pain to me and my family. I hope you okay. don't hurt any other people in this okay. world with your behavior. Okay. okay. Enough. You if go. you want to hit me, I'm hit me, kidding. buddy. That's if you want to do something to me, do it. Okay? Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. I forgive you for hurting me. You hurt me. Okay. All right. It's because you're white. Tell them. That's what he wants to hear, right? She realizes that, what he said? that she screwed up. She realizes that she hurt he me. He already said it several times. I don't recommend you touching him. You're good. I'm just saying. If you okay, touch him, you're allowed right to touch him. So, so is this the representative that you have here? I have a home. All right. You're going to record me, I'll record you. Okay. Um, oh, you're perfect. Gonna go viral for this. this is going to go. I know you want everything to calm down, but he's brought everybody into it. You brought everybody into it. This guy right here has called me drunk. <laughs> so I'm gonna get in my car, I'm gonna call the police, or I'm gonna have a DUI on me now. Get an Uber. I'm drunk. Get an Uber. Get an Uber. Well, he left it. Problem solved. Never mind. Was there any type of. Nope, nothing. He's good. He was just verbally screaming. Yeah. No, nah, I don't. I don't. He's right. Who's the one that called? Inside. I understand, sir. Who called? Inside. So okay. they called inside, but he's. Okay. Did uh, any aggression? Nothing. nothing. No, just, just screaming. He's just right right screaming. Now. Okay. What was he like screaming? Right that's Thank extra. You, sir. That's all extra. He just was mad at the AAA, but they called because they were scared. But he's out of here. Okay. That's it. Got a seatbelt on. He's leaving. Right. Guy cat calls a girl, but quickly finds out that she has claws. What? You're ugly, bruh. Ugly as. You're ugly as. You piece of. Say hi for TikTok. What's up, you little. What's up, you little. Oh, oh, now you're doing the little middle finger, but you wanted to cat call me, huh? Woo! Suck it. I can only wonder why this relationship didn't work out. You can get away from my car. I can't hear you. Thank you. I can't hear you. What did I do to you? I'm not opening the door. Do she you? can hear me perfectly fine. I can't hear you. She can I hear me perfectly you. fine. I can't hear you. Girl, please, can you come back? Can you please come back? I don't know why you left me. Can you please come back? Uh, yeah, use it. Y'all see, y'all see why. Because of me. me go Open the door before the police get called. Why are you doing this? What the f is wrong with you, bro? Can you bro, what's wrong with you, bro? Talk. What's wrong with you? Talk. What did I do? Hello! He's calling the police.
Bro, what did I do? What the f did I do to you? I think I'm gonna get you just how you got me. Can you come back? Does this lady have blood dripping down her face? I can only wonder how that happened. What? I'm on the there phone go, with the there. police. Go ahead. What are you Here, be my, be my You are. Okay. You are. People who are okay, you are. You're. 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 They're all. And what else? They're. What else you called them? With you. Okay. Yeah, you want to lose everything. I'm on the phone with the police. Get on the phone with them. Be my Mexican. I got hey. it. Hey! That is not worth it. Your hair's too Mexican. beautiful. Mexican. She doesn't give up, even when she's already lost. Thank you. Thank you. Hey! 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 They know me. Tell him Drew Bussy. Drew Bussy is here stopping this. Oh, because he thinks he's big, bad, and extra goofy. No, you think you're untouchable. Oh, no, I'm from Texas. I am Me too. You don't know. You don't know. I do. Somebody. I do. Somebody. Somebody needs to Hey, hey. Come get your. You're not the only dude looking at something unpleasant, sir. Are you transgender? Oh, I see it. Yeah, you are. Yeah, you are. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. They would you. They would. They would hang you up by your ankles. He calls another guy racist while reciting a rather infamous salute. Hail Hitler, hail Hitler! Why are you a racist? Why are you bothering me? Uh I I'm sorry, I I, I have more respect for people than using the N-word. And you're waiting, making everybody wait, because it's two kids. The only reason why you guys are waiting is two kids. Really? You're a fing goddamn racist. Really? You 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 got that out got that goddamn racist and and how did you figure that out because there's two kids you, and you don't have any damage dude you have no damage really zero i've what, looked at it what's it got to do with damage they threatened me so just move over the guy threatened me okay and then the move police over. the police are on the way okay well, how long i got to wait wait for what what are you for waiting for the police they're on their way that i'm waiting i've been waiting for almost 2 hours Two hours, you can't move. 75,000 people can't go because you aren't willing to, to move to a parking lot. 75,000 people. Not only are you a racist pig, you're also selfish. You are. You're, I will leave if you admit that you're racist and selfish. I will, I will leave. I promise you. You're racist. You're selfish. Two kids hit you. You gotta get the cops involved. You probably use the N-word. I'm sure you use the N-word every day with your wife. Have you seen what they're doing down there on Avenue Road, those ends? You wanna put them in a cooker? Should we gas them all? I'd like to gas you. I know. Because <laughs> you don't like the truth. And anybody doesn't, if you don't like their truth, you gotta gas them. Wait, you, that th what, the truth, the, the truth is all this that you're making up? All this that you're making up? Did you witness any of this? Did you witness any of it? Nah, f*** off. Just go away. Just go away.
This is just a reminder to refill your popcorn. Please do. You realize you're gonna be a victim when you get hit by a vehicle. Yeah, people no, can't I drive here. I, I said that I slow down. I'm yeah, like pe this. people can't drive here. Especially the Chinese. It doesn't matter. You care. People, you care. People in general can't drive. I know. All you gotta you do is watch what's going on. But you're good at parking. You're not good at driving. There's no damage. You guys can move down the street. It's got nothing to do with the damage. It's got to do with the fact that they then threatened me. Then just move me. down the street together. No. The one guy was there by himself. He threatened me and called his brother to come. And now there's two of them. Got it. I got two against one. Two, that's not cool. But I'm just saying a part of it. I think it should be written into law that if you shoot spit, you get hit. Again with the posters. How is this anybody's priority in life? So why are you taking that down for? Because it doesn't need to be there. Please don't film me. You take it down the sign. Yo, for no, 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 no. So this is in Montclair. The sign. She just took it off. Dude, I don't want to be on What's, the internet. Please don't film me. Why'd you take it off then? I'm asking you to go away, please. Why'd you take it off for? Because it doesn't need to be there. Thank Why? you. You can go away now, please. Why are you taking it off for? You know what? You took it off? You're you're proud about taking it off? Thank you. Why'd you take it off for? Please I'm go not away. going anywhere until you answer my question. Please go away. So why'd you take the sign off? It's right here. There's no reason to be taking it off. It doesn't bother you. So why are you taking the sign off for? Please go away. What's, what was your issue with the sign? I don't want to talk to you. I would like you to go away, please. So do you have a problem with people who are abducted by Hamas? Dude, off. I need you to go away, please. <clears throat> I'm just asking you why you took it away. I have asked you several times to go away. So go the f*** away. I'm not going away. We have asked you several times, very politely, to go away. It's so leave. It's not polite to take down the sign. It's not polite to stand here and film us when we're asking you not to, so f*** off. Dude, I'm not going to. Please leave us alone. So why'd you take it off for? You're not going to go away? We tell you you're not going to go away. We don't tell you. F*** off. Why'd you take off the sign? You're acting like a child. We're asking you to leave. I don't want to talk to you. I especially so don't want you to be filming me. So why did you take the sign off? 
What was wrong with the sign? Are you waiting here all day to bother people? I why need you, you take, to go away. Why did you take the sign off for? So you're okay eating bagels, which is from the Jewish culture, but you're not okay with a vigil for people who are abducted by Hamas. Dude, please leave us alone. Please leave us I alone. Don't, I don't, I don't so want to talk to you. Please, what? can you just... Am I asking who you are? What? Why are you... Can Why? You who who are you? Like, I, I and who are you? I'm just someone who doesn't like the fact that you're bothering people for no reason. Do you know what happened here? What happened here? They're literally eating bagels. What okay, so go about? mind your business. Go mind your business. You're not Why minding, you your, not business? minding your business. Can you f*** off, here? please? Is there a problem? Why don't we just both walk away? No, we're not walking away. Why there was not? a sign here about a vigil for those who are abducted by Hamas, and she just took that off for no reason. It's not bothering her. People can take flyers down. No, so for what reason? What is the issue with that? What is the issue with that? That is not that big of a deal. You okay, don't have to then go leave it. It's not a big deal for me. For me, it's a big deal. Okay, well, I'm sorry that you're having a bad day, and I apologize to you. You're apologizing to them for not, taking down the sign about a vigil about those who are abducted by Hamas. So you're apologizing to them. Have a great day. I think you should leave them alone. That's nice. Thank you. So why did you take the sign off for? I don't want to talk to you. It's my Why did this sign buddy. bother you? I off. We're telling I'm you to go away. Off. Can you off, please? I'm off. I'm not leaving. Go away. It's I'm like, not going it's to not leave. your business. It's not my business. I am Jewish and I'm putting the signs up. You see these signs here? These are signs that I'm putting up. So you just took down the sign that I'm so putting put up. So put up another one if you want to. No, I'm asking you why you took it down. I'm so going to put up another one for sure. You're not even going to put up another one. I'm just, just, asking, I'm just asking you why you took it down. You're very proud to take it down. I saw you from over there. You crumpled it up. You're very proud about it. And now that you're sitting down here, you don't have an explanation for your actions. So I'm just asking you a question why you took it down. What you're trying to do is to say that I'm doing something disrespectful. I didn't like I'm asking you why you took the sign. I'm not, Look, I'm not buddy, saying I'm anything Jewish about too, whether... And there ain't nothing more anti-Semitic than Zionism. Like, you're... Oh. So why did you take the sign off? I just told you why we took it off. Yeah. I'm asking you why you took it off. Please stop recording me. You're going to put it on the internet somewhere, and you're going to claim that you're the one in the right. I'm just asking and you're being a right now to two people who are not... You can't, you can't respond. I just did. Okay. It is fascinating and awful to find out what people will do when they think they aren't being watched. Experiencing a racist door dasher. Mind y'all, I never spoke with her, never seen her or anything. Karen versus Kevin, round two. Tight pants versus bad parking. Who will win? But you race. You are black, but you you are allowed to park here. But then the white ones are not. What? So what? this is my house, and this is not your uh, that's house. That's my excuse. Hey, 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 okay. please back you off. Don't back own off. The house. Step back, please. Step back, oh, please. I'm, I'm, I'm not even getting close to you. I'm getting close to my house. You're right. Step in my back, house. please. Can... Step back. Okay, I'm not to the side to people. Please, next time, just how is? I mean, you don't even. Sit do next to my car, though. If you think about Sit it. next to my car. Like, that's, that's a parking lot. That's a parking lot. No, no, no. Let me film it. You want me to like, I don't understand this man, yo. You want me to do that? Hello, Bella Vista Security. Yeah, Esther. What's up, guys? Believe me, you will regret it. Believe me. What is going on, man? What is going on? This is crazy. This is crazy.
I'd say somebody needs to throw in the towel, but a towel is how this whole thing got started, so maybe it's best not to. Trigger warning. I cut like a sailor. If you're a stay here and you provide towels, I'm gonna use them. You can climb. I know I can. I know I can. We have to charge you. No, you damage the property. You cannot. You cannot. If you want me to damage your property, that's a damage. I could damage your property, my girl. I could definitely do that. That would be no problem whatsoever. But you're not going to tell me that I cannot use towels that a hotel you provide. You cannot threaten me, man. You're threatening me now. You're damaging my property. I'm calling. I'm going to f be calling. You can call Jesus. You can call whoever. I don't give a f mm -hmm. But you can't tell me that I can't you use can towels you that you provided. Yes, ma'am. I need an assistant here, please, immediately. That roofing. I You're going to need Jesus when I'm finished. Me. No, I'm not threatening you. You stole my money. You stole my money. You stole my money. Yeah, they're listening. I you stole my money. Please. I need somebody here. Okay, are you at the front desk? Yes, I am here, and I have a mad person here. Tell her why I'm mad. Because you're telling me that I cannot use the towels that your hotel provides. See, this is why y'all husbands be beating y'all. Because y'all dumb as a box of rocks. Twenty dollars you stole from me because I used towels that your hotel provided. We provide not to lose. Just I didn't lose it. They all up there. No, they're not. They're not washable. I don't give a damn if there was or wasn't. That means. See, but the twenty dollars that you took from me, uh -huh. I make thirty times that in a day. Okay. In a day. So f you, f the raggedy hotel, uh -huh. and f them twenty dollars. Please don't ever show up, girl. F you, please, ma'am. Girl, f you, ma'am. Don't use that. You. For $20, you, crying. you, because you stole it. <laughs> you stole it. Stole You're sitting here telling me that I can't use towels that your hotel provided? Girl, You know towels cost like $7 at Walmart, right? I your towels. I said I used the towels that you provided to me. Well, you're not supposed to, you can't use that, you can't use that many. If you provide them to me, sure. I'm going to use them. Sure. Okay, so if that's a policy of yours, show it to me. Okay. I don't have to show you anything. Yes, you do, because you took my money. Okay. Bottom line. Yeah. Well, stay right here. I'm calling the police. You can call Jesus because it's theft. Yep. If that's a policy, you need to let your, your, your guests know that's a policy. You need to let me know it's a policy. And when I ask to see the policy, show it to me. Don't just take my damn money and think I'm okay with it because I'm not. All right. And so then you left? Yeah. Okay. So did you make any threats to her earlier? No. She said, um... I got it all recorded. Okay. She said, um, you damaged my property. I said, no, I didn't damage your property. But if you want me to damage your property, I could definitely okay. damage your property. Did you say you're going to burn down the building? No. Okay. I have it all recorded. I have the whole interaction okay. recorded. She's got some recordings, too, that I'm going to listen right. to both of yours. Um, regarding her taking the money and that stuff, you got to go through the management. Through Red who, who is she? I just, you know, the management for this, but you have to go through the... Book the corporation, okay? I can't. No, no, no. These, these are privately owned. Okay. You're going to have to go through the Red Roof Corporation because. I didn't reserve through the Red Roof Corporation. I didn't pay the Red Roof Corporation. Okay. I'm just. Red Roof Corporation didn't take my money. Right. She did. Okay. This is all. That would be a civil matter that we wouldn't get involved with if, you know, regarding the damage to the towels. Okay. It's not a police matter. And it wasn't as. So, you know, the only okay, thing so... we're concerned about is she's saying that you made these threats and you got these issues with them. So I'm just going to, you know, follow up with her. Listen to her stuff, listen to your stuff, and uh, see what she wants done, and, you know, go from there, all okay, right? Okay, that's fine. You want to play the recording for me? Sure. They're $15 if you get a set. Two for each of you. Is any of this really necessary? Right, Rupert, police which I don't think you plan on anyway. Never. Like so if you do come back, then there could be enforcement action, but I don't think I have to worry about that. Okay. Now, I'll let you listen to... Mine. You I said, did. You said she had some as well. Did you listen to hers? I didn't listen to hers because I just listened to yours, and I think she's going to show me the same stuff. Okay. All right. I just want to know what the threats come in at. Yeah. Because that's that was the reason for her to call y'all, and that's the reason why y'all got out here. What she proceeded that this threat was, you know, I think you said like, oh, you want to see damage, which I'm not saying you know is a threat by Connecticut law, but uh, you know, that's what she thought was a threat. That's okay. what I'm assuming. Okay. Okay. All right, so if you can just hang out for a couple more seconds.
The audacity of this dude driving the car to complain about entitlement as he's taking up the entire bike lane with his massive vehicle. All I'm asking you to do is move out of the bike lane. I don't lane. care what you're asking. I don't got to comply with you. you no, of course not. But that's just the law. So go your around. It's not safe. I don't want to go into the condo lane. Your life is not my concern. I understand that. I am, in fact. Uh, <laughs> I knew it. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it, I knew you was a Jew. <laughs> you people are the devil. Now we're going to... I knew it. You are the devil. Now we're going to... Hey, bro, get the camera, bro. She is trash. This is why you're doing this, because you think you're a tight... I don't know about you, but I feel like getting into an argument with an Uber driver isn't worth it if you got someplace to be. They're going to arrest your Course, right? When he came back, what was the first thing he told you? He, he said, got out. He said, listen, he, he said, if car, you get out, I'm you know, a what? I, I, know, I was trying to tell so you listen, that man, before so you yeah, even started talking, talking to me. Yeah, before I tell you, listen I, to somebody listen. who has experience in life. If I'm putting you on game, right? So you're asking I'm why not, I'm not going. Be, I'm not going because you're manipulating. The same thing you say you not want to do or you went through, you're doing the exact same, and you're using all these excuses of why you're still up. So you're 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 the type of person you're gonna have to bump your head for you to learn. So when somebody who is older than you, I want to tell you right now, you're Australopithecus cro magnon rock stupid. You're retarded. You're down syndrome. I don't give a you do not understand that your literacy level needs to be brought up from Mary on a trench and you have a issue with your intelligence. When the bites come and the ants come at me, it'll take 10,000, 100,000 of them to take me down. So that's how minuscule you are to my size, right? My stature of intelligence, character, body, and um, reverence in the world. So 1K is better for this doesn't want to give away his millions. Are you Jewish? No, man, because I'm going to do movies, stand-up, comedy, everything, all this. Music, whatever the e commerce, you don't understand that you're talking to like a Michelangelo of my time, right? Like I'm a genius, Albert Einstein level history bookmaker. You're gonna be forgotten like the dust in the sand when you're in the Sahara and there's hundred million, thousand billion sand particles. You're gonna be one of those, and I'm gonna be a statue erected in gold. So understand, I, that. I am like this because uh, ADHD, autism, neurodivergent. I, I have ADHD you. as well, right? But because you said that's what the mask is, I think you're all right, so that's why. You're really cool, Dream. I still want to fight you. And all of it's happened tonight. It's not going to make it a like brutal marauder. It's, I'm not going to be a brutal marauder. I'm going to like literally like either you're going to be paralyzed or you're going to be dead. Like I'm serious. Okay, man. Can you, you fight? Oh, of course. Yeah. Irel, I yeah. apologize. Oh my God, I'm good. I know. I I'm sorry. Him, for I met him tonight. But yeah, you get on the. Go about your business, would you, man? <laughs> Have you got the video? Yeah. We really need to put, report him. In this saga, the desk clerk gives a key card for a room that already has guests in it to another random customer. The situation is, this is a girl's trip. It's all females. Our front desk rep allowed two men to have a key card to our room and come upstairs in our room while we were in the room. Walking no identification. No identification. No last, no accent for no last name. He did not, they told them Jessica, a random name, which is my first name, no last name, and he gave him a key card to our room. Mind you, this isn't the first incident because earlier, her mom, who's sick in the hotel room, that we're constantly on the phone with back and forth while we're trying to enjoy ourselves on the trip, said that somebody was trying to get in the room early and she had to lock the door. 
put a lock on it. She had to put a lock on it, and we wondering like why the key card is not working. We came back down here and asked for another key card. This was prior to this last situation that just happened around 3.15 while we're upstairs in the room. And our they walked in the actual room, two men, one with a mask on. I didn't see them because I was in the room, but they're asking for me. Now, one time we even came in contact with men on this trip. And they didn't even know who she was because they walked in the door and was like, are you Jessica? Are you Jessica? They no, didn't even know who she was. I don't even was. know who he is or who the person is. I don't even know what they look like. I asked him, did you even get his ID before you gave him our key card to our room? We have so much designer expensive stuff up there. You know how much human trafficking and everything is going on? And you gave somebody access to our room just off Jessica in this room. I could have sat in the lobby just randomly and I uh, and listen, oh yeah, where room y'all in? We going up to this room. Okay. You didn't even get an idea or anything. I asked him for his first and last name. He gave me the first name. You don't even want to cooperate, but you gave somebody a key card we, for a room. We also asked him, did he take the key? He said yes and then turned around and said no. Okay. Okay. Pause and let him talk. Okay. Try to get the story. Okay. So, okay. once he had said that, I had told him, I do not have sheets down here at the front desk. I will have to call my security officers to have my security officers bring them up to the room for them. So, then after that, I had gave him the room. Then he pulled out $100 in cash and placed it down right over here. And I looked at oh, You saw it, us. Whenever we all look through the camera, you mm -hmm. will see that. He pulled the cash, he put it right over wow. on the table. And I looked at him mm -hmm. and I was like, what is that for? And then he was like, I'm just over here trying to tip you. And I was like, $100? I was like, do you really need change? Or like, are you just tipping me $100? He was like, I'm going to speak with her to see exactly what she wants to do. And I was like, sold us for $100. Wow. I didn't take it. I didn't take, I didn't take it from him. And the cashier starts looking a little suspicious. I don't care if you took it. Your room number, he... I'm going to need you to step back. I need to talk to him now. Please, I called because the two guys walked in our room with their key. Um, the other Seven, three, three, with three, three, us, she was laying on the couch. I was in the bathroom. I heard her talking to someone. She says, "What are y'all doing in here? Who who is who are y'all?" And they like, "This not 3602. I mean, this not 3604." And we, she like, "No, who are y'all?" And they kind of backed out and left. I got out the bathroom like somebody was just in here, and she told me, "Yeah." So I thought that multiple keys work for multiple rooms. So I called downstairs and says, two guys walked in our room. Why does their key card work for our room? And, and he said, and that's when he told me, he told me, she has the floor right now. Exactly what he, he told me that, right now. Exactly he, he told me that it's, that's funny because two guys came down here, asked for Jessica and gave me your room number and I gave them a key. I said, well, you gave them a key to our room? I'm coming down. I hung up the phone with him and I came downstairs. Which one? Who's Jessica? Me! Jessica, I right? came downstairs. The two guys were right there. It was me and the other girl who's upstairs right now. It's my sister. She said, we came downstairs. We're trying to figure out why he gave us them a key to our room. The guy said, what's your name? Talking to my friend. She, he said, what's your name? So obviously he doesn't know Jessica. I, got, said, I have a question too. And she like, what you, no. she ain't never answered. But and I he just said, have your question. name, Je you Jessica? And I'm like, no. But my thing is, why are you looking for Jessica? And, and that's true. We, so I mean, so I'm saying, like, what happened? What was his response? He was saying he like, I'm sorry, it's, it's, um, it shouldn't be an inconvenience. I'm sorry, I didn't apologize. I didn't mean anything. Can I take you on a date to accommodate? Can I take you on a date to accommodate that? Can I make it up to you? And I'm ignoring him. I'm ignoring him totally because I'm focused on why he would give anyone a room key. He had not once seen us walk in here with no guys. No it's men have been, been here. My name, my name is the We never. never no. I don't, I don't even know what they look We've like. Been on a my name is on the reservation. I put her name we on there as so she can have a key card. So here. initially, he shouldn't even anyone. be giving a key card to a male if I put her name on there. I can see if a female came down here and say, well, well, I'm Jessica and I need a key card, but you gave it to a male that's asking for a it's female's a name. But not only that, one man. and my name you is the original name Jessica. on the um, Where is the last name basis for you to estate a key? Is it like, right, can it be more than one Jessica in this hotel? Exactly. exactly. But he's saying it's not just Jessica, it's just the room it's number. Jessica. What do you guys think about this one? We never came in contact with any men. We've been on a private guy since we got here. And facts is, we've it's cameras all through here. You haven't seen not, not one, one man. man. 
You can run the cameras I've been here since last you know Sunday. I hear you on that, but that's not up, up to him to monitor that. That's that, I, that I understand, understand that too. But it's not up to him to give someone our room key. With well, just the first name. On our Which room. We, we gonna address. Now he, now he operate based on policy. At the end, like at the end of this, if it's an issue, nigga, that's something you gotta take over. Corporate him is management. Like, we will. Yeah, that's I what already contacted my lawyer. Right. So they can For adjust sure. it. Cause. Like I said, if you're saying that's a policy, I personally... It don't make sense. And can we see the policy? And then, and then for them not to even know who she is, is my whole thing. How are you asking for her and you don't even know who she is and what she they look like? Y'all yeah, can't talk her. Right. Exactly, that's what I'm saying. Come on. That don't even, that's not making sense. Okay. Do you do you need the other two ladies who um? No, no, you two is fine. It's, it's okay, fine. just ask. Okay. Okay. Because remember, it's mostly between the situation, mostly between you guys and, and the company. But uh, this is this has something to do with the policy. Exactly. Okay, so basically, I'm just going to document a report about what happened today, and, and that's it. You know. Okay. Uh, there's no crime committed here. Okay, it's just mostly like a civil issue. So this report is just going to be, you know, going to be in favor of you. Okay. okay. Thank you. I can't tell if it's better or worse that we didn't get to see what happened here. Uh, well, I'm not criminally responsible. I'm going out the mental health act, so we'll take care of you, Dirk and Dirk. Don't you remember it? Don't you Like I said before, in war, everyone loses. Hey guys, so I was just doing a get ready with me as one would on their main account. Like, I mean, I just make them for fun. I never really post them, but I started telling the story to myself and I realized that I had a story to share. So if you did not know, my next door neighbor in my apartment, like my apartment neighbor is from Palestine. And my entire floor is like, all AU Pi guys, so all Jewish guys, but happens to be the one person right next to me is from Palestine. So I'm gonna tell you how I figured out he's from Palestine as I drink my little homemade April Spritz. So I don't have much time because all I have left to do is my eyelashes and highlighter and lips. But um so basically, so the other day I'm getting ready to go out and this guy, like someone is just knocking on the door no one's answering the door. So I get up and I open the door and it's this guy that I've never seen before. And he's like, he looked like Indian or something, or I don't know, like whatever. And so I get up and I open the door and I'm like, hi, and he's like, hi, I just wanted to introduce myself. Like I just moved in next door, like, or like down the hall, but like on the end of the hall and he pointed like towards the end and there's only two apartments on the other side. And so I was like, oh, hi, nice to meet you. And he's like, yeah, I'm And I was like, okay, like, nice to meet you, whatever. And so then I go and I tell my roommates, and I said, this random guy just introduced himself. It's kind of odd. And so one of my roommates goes running out to the door, like, uh, to his door. But we weren't sure which door it was, like, which of the two. And so I was like, wait, I don't know if that's it or not. And so she comes sprinting back. She was scared that, the, like, random people were going to open the door. And all of a sudden, opens the door. And, um... He's like, wow, that was a fast run. He, like, comes over. They invite him in. I'm still getting ready. I'm not really, like, I'm not even going out with them. Like, I was just, they were leaving before me, so I was going to just pre in with them for a little before they left and whatever. And so he's in here, and he's like, where are you going today? I'm like, oh, I'm going to AE Pie. Like, and he's like, oh, like, I've never been to an AE Pie party before. Like, how are they? And I was like, oh, you know, like, like, they're fun. Like, I'm just trying to find, like, a nice, like, nice Jewish boy, a good NJB for me. Like, um... What did I say? Wait, I'm um, forgetting. Okay, and so my roommate, who is not Jewish, she's from uh, New York, but she's Christian or Catholic or whatever. I don't really know the difference. She's like, yeah, like he's kind, of, like he's really cute. Like I want to get with him. And I was like, where's he from? And she goes, Al son. And I'm like, huh? Like, hmm? So yeah, she's just casually like, yeah, like he's from Palestine. And I'm like, what? Like literally my jaw's like dropping. And she's like, what? Like, why is that such a big deal? 
and I was like, do you not know anything? Like, he probably wants to, like, me right now. Like, I was just out there, like, talk, talking proudly about how I'm Jewish, which obviously I'm very proud to be Jewish, and I love being Jewish, but I mean, I had to cook, cooked, kicked that guy out. This, I, I wouldn't have even opened the door for him if I had known that he was from Palestine, let alone, like, let him in and have a full conversation with him. Like, he was telling me he was going to help me get into the IBW workshop because he was, he was in it. Which is like, like that, it's like at Indiana you need to be in like these workshops to get like a good job. So IBW is like the investment banking workshop and they basically they set you up with good jobs. And he's like, yeah, like I'll help you out, like all good, like whatever. Like I would never invite him to the apartment in the first place. So I literally said to her, I was like, okay, like he's not allowed back in here ever again. We're never getting with him. Like, like you live with me. We're never going near that guy ever again. Like. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah so that's my story about how my next door neighbor is in palestine when i could have had any ae pie guy like all the doors down the other direction are ae pie but then that way is palestine so yeah and wait um if you ever come near me i have pepper spray ready to go so Wish me luck! Anyways, time to go to a pie with my Stella Jews. Honestly, I believe it's real, but it's almost so perfect that it seems rehearsed. Tough guy, I need you to be quiet right now, sir. Oh, uh, what are you gonna do? I'm gonna what evict. The from the hotel, idea. and I recommend you get out of my face. Or what? Nathan, call 911! This guy literally called his mom because the Uber driver parked a little bit out of the way. I think he loses. Basketball, why don't you pull up down here? Huh? What you mean, brother? I'm outside playing basketball, brother. I'm locked out my crib. Why would you pull into my crib? And when I tell you to come to the rim, when you see me go, go. Wait, 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 don't, don't, me don't, 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 don't talk to me like that, my brother. That's you, cool. If I you, appreciate if, you. If you, you my money already spent, brother. I, 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 that's not my fault, my brother. I feel you, cuz. But your request right here, I have to, I have to come here. If you had any problem, just request another Uber, my brother. No, but not, no, nah, 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 nah. My nah. money gone, brother. Oh, okay, so go. uh, doesn't matter, but well, not. Shut up, go, cuz. No, 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 go, 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 go. No, I'm not, I'm not gonna let you talk to me like that. Cuz. Request another Uber. Before you open this door, drop I will, me I will, I will, I will, I will call the police right now. You gonna request my Uber? No, 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 get out of my car, my brother. Uber is requesting you right here. Get out. So, no, 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 you're not, you're not, you're not gonna treat me like that, my brother. I feel I'm you, doing, I'm doing my, bro, my, my job. I know, Just man. call me and say, my brother, can so, you call my brother, why are you opening the door, man to man? Call the door, say no, what no, you no, gotta no. say. Talking about the get, police, man. Get out. No, no, no. So where my money at, Leo? Face? Uh, uh, your money Uber will will, will give you money back, and not me. I I don't deal with that. Well, that ain't happening on Mac today. What you talking about? Cause you opened this door like you with that. I call the cops. Mom, Leo, baby, just pulled on this. No, 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 no. Right no. Up the street, tried me, bro. And he gonna please. open his door. And Kevin pulled the ultimate Kevin card by asking for the manager, but in Japan. Get the manager now. Get the manager now. I don't care. Get the manager now. Get the manager now. Get the manager now. Get All right. What substance was this guy on? Leave your thoughts in the comments. Bitch, you were the slave. Who was the problem? Right. You were. You were the slave, not me. But you I'm white. Yeah, you're white. You think you about that? You gotta live with that. Right, exactly. He you were me. And that's why you got a black guy now, and I'm gonna give you a hey. I will beat your Wash your mouth. I'm not the one that will beat your Do you understand me? I don't care about those things. It's what I would say because of you. My name is Lord. You talk your name. I'll stop you again, and I'll give you a Hi. Happy birthday to me. Today is my birthday. Last night, I got into a terrible fight. Uh, it was a beautiful day. I <laughs> spent most of it with my good friend Jamie Lynn at her fashion show. And then onward, I tried to meet 
Booby at the Kiss concert because Kiss is doing their show. Uh, they had their show last night. And then I thought, well, I did try to meet him, but the city was melee. Onward, I thought, let's go to the townhouse. So I went to the townhouse and, uh, you know, I've never really been this vocal to everybody, but I had to bartend there for six months and it was utter terror and horror. I hated it. Uh, but you go back there when you want to go back to the townhouse. Anyway, I was in the neighborhood. I was on the Upper East Side. And I went in there and um, met a very nice gentleman. And uh, this dude pushed me, started pushing me. And obviously he had been talking to the same gentleman so I got basically attacked by a professional prostitute. I got attacked and I got into a fight with the prostitute. The prostitute did this to me. He has been on social media all day long. But guess what? He's bald now. I ripped out all of his dreadlocks. I, I thought it was a wig, but those were his real dreadlocks. I ripped his hair out. And I'm sorry, but I had to use the N-word. Oopsie. Boopsie boopsie. If you are one, you are one. Especially if you act like one. Of a mother. Of a mother's Hit me in my goddamn eye. I am beautiful. God damn it. I am gorgeous. And I only stopped in just to meet a cutie. And I met a cutie. And this man jumped on me. This prostitute jumped on me. And I ended up using the N word. And this is what happened. He knocked, he hit me in the eye. And, um,. We ended up rolling around on 53rd Street, and uh, I ripped all of his dreadlocks out. I, I actually thought those were weaves. <laughs> that was his real hair. <laughs> I ripped out his real hair, so homeboy is bald now. Who does this help exactly? And how? Cease fire now! 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 This supremely unpleasant Karen shouts some racist nonsense and follows it up with a spell that made the furniture in my room start floating. Man. When doing your job goes wrong. See the garbage? Ma'am. Ma'am? Ma and you throw it in the garbage can. Ma'am? Do you understand? You have a nice day. Please. You young ass savage animal. Is your uncle Kushika? Ah, I understand your fing really getting rid dialect. You're a blow up doll. Ma'am. You're not even a human being. Ma'am. Shut the f up. Ma'am, please have a shut nice day. Shut up. Ma'am, I am leaving and shut the f up. I run you over with the truck. Ma'am, please. Here's some more garbage. Oh, wait a minute. Which are 
Do you guys think he's leaving out of, well, what he said? I'm not leaving out of 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 Making See, even with the context completely missing, the way she acts here makes me naturally side with the driver more. Me and my viewers want to know what goes to the head of a stupid person. Because what you did back there was really dumb. You have, I'm not loaded, so I'm only 40,000 pounds right now. But you have a 40,000 pound rig coming full speed ahead at you, 100 feet in front of them, you think it's a good idea to pull out. So what goes through the head of a stupid person? Tell us, we want to know. Are you live streaming while you're driving? How can I do that? There's no service here. I don't know why. And does it look like I'm driving right now? You are a very stupid person, aren't you? You're one of the stupidest people I've ever met. Do not, and I repeat, do not pull out in front of trucks ever again, because that's how people die. And I don't want to people. All right, I'm going to walk away from this stupid person while I still have a little bit of sanity left. And by the way, they work for the state of Alaska. Or the U.S. government, anyway. So, nice to know we have stupid people that work for the U.S. government. Big shocker there, hey? All right, you all keep on trucking. As if public transport wasn't already a headache to deal with on its own. This is the one line. Angle Lake. Please report anything suspicious. Employee. Watch out, bro. Watch out, bro. <laughs> Karen versus Kevin bonus round. The Karen teller, the Kevin customer, or the guy who invented this rule. So if my mom walks up with a $50 bill, you're, going, you're not going to take the cash from her? If it's her credit card, then we happily would take the payment for her. If you were a signer on that account, we would happily make that payment for you. Okay, well, I've never heard, that's a, I'm still going to get on social media and blast JP Morgan Chase for this. Oh, I am. Time. Trust me, I am. And as you know, social media gets a whole lot of attention. So I'm not going to call Chase and complain. I'm going to blast him on social media. Either way, whatever you want to do, it's fine. I agree with you, actually. My mom is 78. She lives 130 miles from here, but they won't take a cash payment for credit card. It's not their fault. How do you think I feel? Okay. Go tell me to get a money order. That's great. It's not customer service. Not at all. Strap in for this drunken stripper who gets pulled over for a hit and run. Okay. Why'd you get on me like that? Twenty six at quarters. It's a female. All right, step out. A white step female. Out. Put your hands behind your back. Put your hands behind your back. Why did you take off like that? I'm sorry.
What, are you drinking or something? No. Where are you coming from? Broadway. Can you stop pulling me like that? Nope. Do you have anything in your pockets? Oh yeah? Oh yeah? <laughs> oh, I don't back. know, you wanna check me? <clears throat> Touch me real quick. It may feel intervised. Alright, stop. Sitting there. No, you don't wanna stop. Are you on something right now? No. I just came for dinner with my trick. How much you have to drink there? Two doubles. Two doubles of what? Patron. Okay. So you are drunk. And I'm going to keep it a buck with you. Where's the owner of that vehicle? I don't know. Who's Don to Smith? I just bought it. What is your name? Stay in Grace. the car. Stay in the car. Okay, I understand. Get in the car. I, okay. Get your leg in the car. Listen, handsome man. Get your leg in the car. You feel some type of way because my leg ain't in the car? Get your foot in the car. Just stop. It's what is your name? Grace. Grace what? Seducing a cop ain't gonna work here. I'm telling you I'm not. Like, I'm telling you that I am, but I'm not. None of that even makes sense. Clear. Confirming okay, she's whatever. under 21. Three doubles. Three doubles? Yeah. We're at so six. You had six drinks? Six drinks of Patron. That's why it smells With like that. Clear. With a lime too? A lime. Damn. You know that's Where were you drinking? Okay. Where you where are you drinking? I was drinking at my friend's house. At dinner? Where does your friend live? I really don't know. Because I'm not from I'm Ohio. Yeah, you want to handle the code too? Yeah, I handle just the code got too. in Ohio two days so ago. A C D A. E C D A. I'm just gonna do H G N. Have you had an OBI before? What's no. Up? I don't like talking to you between these bars. Can I talk to you in person? You are talking to me in person. No, I'm not. I'm talking to you between bars right now. You want to? Okay. That? What's your current address right now? Where are you staying? Don't worry about all that. What's your current? Well, I need your current address. No, I'm not giving it to you. You need to give me your current address right now. And what do you want to do if I don't? I'm going to charge you with jail? obstructing. Constructing what? Obstructing official business. What is okay, your address? Okay, that's cool. Address? I don't care. Hey, guess what? Uh. Your bouncer that works in my club, because I'm a stripper. At Christie's? Right? No. Where? Hustlers. Where's that? What do you mean, what the f is that? Where is it? Like, where's what the business? What do you mean, where is it? You know. Don't. don't play dumb with me. I ain't that dumb Okay. Don't play me like that. Okay. It's downtown. Okay. That's fine. So, at least seven different officers want to uh, report me mm -hmm. as I'm up. Because I want to sleep with them. Because I work there. Okay. You don't care because you want You want You don't care you don't care. Take me to the office where your investigators do for second that and let me know about my abduction. I don't care. I'm so Did she just spit on you? All right, she's going down. We're not going to test her. According to the comments, this person may very well have been through some uh, awful things. Some truly awful things. But y'all didn't. Right, I, I got you. No. No, you don't. I don't. No, you don't. Bro. Right. No, you don't, bro. Right. I got you. No, you don't. Bro. Stand by for a minute. No, hey, hey, don't. come stand right here at this window. No. Stay right here. No.
Watch out for all that. You're right. You're trying to put me in New Mexico! Right. Quiet! And get in the car! You're trying to put me in New Mexico! No, we're no, not! Don't kick, don't kick, don't yes. kick! Don't you're kick! Trying to, you're, yes. trying to, you're trying to put me in New Mexico! Yes, you're no. gonna be in your own urine here in a second. Just sit up, dear. <laughs> Bath and Body Works, until Karens like this step in, and then it doesn't. Her kids were out playing with a manatee, which is illegal since they're endangered. Get physical near the end. Fine. She's got kids too, so she's a mother. This is how she, this is how a mother behaves. That's right. Look how the you behave. You're drinking in front of your kids. What the are you talking about? I'm I'm, so over, I'm well over so 21 years old. Okay. It's all the mind. I wouldn't act like my kids. Okay. I wouldn't like my kids. What are bigger. you protected with your hey, camera? You protected with your camera? Hey, hey.
It's all pure theater at the movie theater. One shop suspiciously. Hey, they got who on the radar? You guys are already on the radar as far as known shoplifters. Well, I don't even live here. That's fine. I live but in Texas and I have never been to this Myers. Buying anything, then we're gonna have to ask you to leave. But we got you're stuff in our hand. Then you guys can go ahead and proceed, but you're right, already on. on you're already on the radar. Okay. On the radar for what though? Myers. But how we on the radar and I never listen, been here before. Listen, I don't I'm not here to argue with you. But I am because that's racially profiling. No, if you're on the radar. So how I've never been to this Myers. Right, what is the picture of us? Or right, I need to see. Okay, see? okay let me see. Cause I've never been to this Myers let's before. Go, let's go, let's go, so let's go. Cause what well, now, yes, I will suit up out of Myers. Please. So what? Well, I gotta make sure I record all this. Cause how I'm on the radar, we're the manager. Well, how we on the radar? What the hell? We never even been out here. Yeah, we literally just walked in. Just walked in this. Right. Can't even These girls would like to know why they're on the radar. Yeah, cause I never been to this Myers before. I don't even live here. I was just gotten a call on you and what um, do you mean a call on me for what um one of my um employees all right because we just literally activity. walked in how some we just walked in literally so how y'all like notice some suspicious ago. activities 
I, I was just um, Okay, so where the employee at? Yeah. So y'all really, really stealing stealing Be quiet. I'm not, I'm not gonna argue with y'all neither because I'm definitely gonna sue y'all. This is definitely getting recorded because that's racially profiling. Don't we call no police in this and we I'll ain't in here shoplifting or none of that. We literally just, just walked in here and y'all saying y'all, y'all, like what? Listen, listen, we're not gonna what? Argue. We just we're walked not, in here. Listen. Be for real. What did I but y'all racially profiled. I'm not racially profiled. Yes, you are. You. Listen, if you're shopping, so but you told us we got to go. Stop arguing with me for a minute. Stop listen. arguing. You, you, you keep listen. saying just listen, but y'all are being. That's, this is crazy. Talking, just listen. Because what y'all said, I'm like, listen. said is an employee called on you. Think okay, that you see the employee. Stop yet? arguing with me. One of the cop yells at you and tells you to stop talking. Most of the time, they know they're wrong and they just want to try to lie their way out of it. But let's continue. Let's see how this goes. Argue. I'm asking you a question. Stop. The answer is no to that. Why not? That's okay. our rights to ask. Okay. An employee, an employee, an employee call. call. I don't yep. Okay. An employee call, and you're saying Take you guys were doing else. suspicious yeah. activity as far as looking, checking, looking. Why the looking, 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 looking. I wonder if all shoppers get this welcome when they come in. That's okay. our rights to ask. An okay. Employee, an employee an call. call. Yeah. Okay. An employee call, okay. and you're saying Take you guys were doing else. suspicious yeah. activity as far as looking, checking, looking. We Why we can't hey, look and check? Would you quit cutting me off? But that's not nothing that's suspicious right. that we in here. Let, let what? Finish. How do you let shop? When you shop, what do you let do? Him, you look through him. stuff, right? If you're gonna record me, I'm recording. Go let, ahead. Let me. I'm talk letting you talk. Go ahead. So I can explain Go ahead. the situation. Okay. Okay. When an employee calls saying that you're doing, you're checking around, you're shopping suspiciously. All right. You might be up to <laughs> shopping suspiciously. Quit cutting me off. I can go off. I'm just laughing okay. at you, but go ahead. Otherwise, you guys can beat feet out of you here. You already told to us we can layers. leave. I got that on camera, too. What I'm saying is, okay, if you guys oh, are... Listen, I, I'm done. Be quiet, okay, Brianna. All I'm saying is, all you guys are doing is we just, off. we literally you just walked in here. Two, right before y'all walked in, we Stop walked talking. in. Okay? But see, further, we're not finna do. You ain't finna put your finger in my face. See, that's, man. See, that, that's how you know, like, they just be... They really do be caring about that power too much. Like, he really is trying to be like, stop talking. Like, stop. Like, no. Like, you was not making no sense. But let's continue. But you keep stop telling us to stop talking. You're not listening. You won't listen. What he's trying to tell us is if you're not stealing stuff, you can keep shopping. Yes. So you guys won't but stop why do we want to keep shopping here? somewhere no, where they no, caught no, the police on us so we're not even mean. doing nothing? That's all. No, what no, what, 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 what no, am I doing? But who want to keep, who want to buy something from somewhere and y'all, y'all accused of something we just walked in here? Like, what? No, we're not going to keep shopping. We're not going to keep shopping because that's weird. Come on. Like, what? You do know. Yes, y'all do, but it's okay. It's okay. This I just... What? Hey, you left your backpack, I, sir. No, no, I did. Give me my sandwich. I need you to take Give your backpack my sandwich. and release, please. Give me my sandwich. Give me my sandwich. Give me my sandwich. Sir, I need you to take Give your... Give me my sandwich. Please. Give me my sandwich. Give me my sandwich. Give me my... Uh, this is okay, take the chips, please my, leave. No, I need here to give me my. How about that? You think I'm stupid? Man threatens to call the police because a man pointed at him. Hey, nobody tell him the entire internet is pointing and laughing at him now. He might have us all arrested. What you do, you're more entitled to. Right now, holding the body for you, so I need to know if you know what you're doing is wrong. This guy put your luggage up there. His luggage up here now. You don't have any space. Yeah, I got you. Now there's no space. He's got no space. He have no space because he put his luggage up here. Look. The maximum is going to be. Sir, I'm going to ask you one more time. If you continue. No, please don't stop. point please, it. Don't please, put your finger please, at it. Please stop. You put your finger I'm at me one more time, I'm, I'm going to call the police. I'm going to tell you to stop. No, if you put your finger at me one more time, I'm going to call the police. I'm not pointing no fingers. I'm just saying to no, you. No, you point your, your finger at me. You need to stop with this whole luggage. Point your finger at me. I'm going to call the police. I'm going to call the police on me. 
No, you point the your point. Your Nothing, finger. sir. That's okay. That's okay. Yeah. Uh, are you seeing where this light? No, I'll go with it. Yeah, go with it. Yeah, okay. Grab our side. Uh -huh. Okay, but well, the camera copy one. Seatbelt sign is on. Please be seated and fasten your seatbelt. Karen goes postal on some postal workers. Delivery driver who handles herself like a pro. I'm so sorry. No, you're fine. You're totally fine. I'm not sorry. I don't give up. Go to hell. Go to hell. Get out of my face. Did you get your package? You need to get out of my face. You need to go. Go. I don't need to go anywhere. Go. Then, okay. Then get out. I'm, I don't give up. Don't even start with this rant with me because I ain't listening. Goodbye. Are you done? Okay. No, I'm not done. Well, don't talk to me because I ain't listening. <laughs> Bye. Kiss my Bye. What? I said bye. -eye. You need to come through? I'm here. You're good. You okay? I don't know where he come from, but... Get the f Get Get in your car! Blah, 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 blah. Yo had a kid in the back the whole time? Get out of here! Get out of here! What? Get, get out of my face is what I'm saying! Go! Bye! Stop talking to me! Nobody wants to talk to you! Bye! I don't give up! Bye! Bye! I don't care, yo! Bye! Excuse me, sorry. Karen could have chosen anywhere else in the park to sit down. And she chooses the middle of a skate park. Just to be mean. So we came to this skate park and had a woman sitting completely in the way. She refused to move after several attempts to make her understand that nobody can skate this way. So even the kids started trying to make her move. Then I had this idea. As she sat perfectly to try something, LOL. <laughs> Almost everybody loved it. And then I flipped to celebrate. <laughs> Guess what? She still didn't approve. How about a little education on Scientology? They flew them over here, a billion people. And they dropped them in a vol volcano. This is this religion, this is what they believe. They dropped those frozen popsicle people in a volcano. And then dropped like an atomic bomb on it. Right? You with me? You staying with me? Right? And essentially the souls from those people went up in the air and I guess they got intercepted and spun out and they were flung all over earth and then they attached to us to the people so we got these how do they call them thetans there they are oh look at them He's like, oh man look at that he's out there guys he's out there so anyway they flung these souls of these people these popsicle people that they put in the volcano and, and use an atomic weapon on them. Those souls got flung out and they attached to us. And so their whole goal is to unattach those souls from us, those thetans. 
They want to, we have to unattach, have those unattached from us. And then once we do that, I'll be honest with you, they say that they live forever. They live forever, that's what they think. You know, it's a wild story, right? Now, I'll go to the movies and see that story. I will. I, I Maybe, probably not. I probably won't, to be honest with you. But it's just one of those stories you say, okay, you know, it's kind of goofy. But imagine hearing that story and saying, oh my God, I love it so much. It all makes sense now. Now, I'm going to give my life to this. And I mean, I'm not just going to join it like a regular religion. I mean, I'm going to completely give it all. All my money. Give up my family. Give up my friends. Go join this place. Hop on the bus. On the spaceship. On the, on the Space Navy ship. And hop on that bus. Go back to this apartment building. I guess just read Dianetics nonstop, and then come back to work every day over here at this building and work six, seven days a week, make absolutely no money as you keep on learning more and more about that story I just told you. I mean, that's just a little, that's just a tiny bit. That's a tiny bit. I mean, it keeps on going on. I mean, you want to look at what their so-called Bible looks like. If you just Google operating thetans, I mean, it's 1018 now. I've, they're a little delayed. I think they're going to get a little less sleep. Oh, God. Look at this guy. Mr. Goody, what's the problem? Oh, uh, I see they call me out by name. Uh, what's my problem? I have no problem. Do you have a problem? You got the camera on me. Okay, there you go. I was minding my business. I didn't ask you to come over here. If you want to keep me company, knock yourself out. I don't really care. I'm not really interested. Okay, good. This is like you're harassing people. This is not harassment. This yep, is, is. I am educating the public about a cult. Your cult. And then Officer Funtime shows up. I mean, just because you want to be in a cult, I think the public has a right to know. Matter of you fact... You don't care about a cult or anything. You care about LAPD. That's all over your Twitter page. That's what you do in life. That's all I do in life? What yeah. you do in life is you're a security guard in life. No, I'm not. Uh, I mean, literally, literally, you are a security guard for the Scientologists. That's the dumbest thing you can say, man. You are literally a security guard for the Scientologists. And you're literally, you're, you're, you're literally a security, a security guard, guard for the Scientologists. You gave your life to this. You signed a billion-year contract, and you're saying something's dumb? And I did. You signed a What's billion, a billion years. So I'm going to read to you, and you, and you, I'm going to read to you OET8, because it says here, if I read OT8 to you, See, they think that if you read, so they have these different levels. It's not OT. OT well, mind your, mind your business. It's not OT. Mind your business. I'm, t I'm in. It's not OT. You wouldn't know because it's, it's not OT. your level. You're below it. And so what I'm saying, either because you don't. Because know I have the operating OT. thetan, and I'm going to show it to you, you right know, now. You don't and know anything and about possibly, about if you believe what it you says, you will explode in flames. Will you explode in flames if you learn? I don't care. What's the definition of Scientology? Cult. It's called a cult. It's called a cult. The definition of Scientology is called a cult. The it's definition. Not. Mr. Goody. That, the you definition. Have more important things to do than. I don't have more important things to do than to shut down a cult. I don't. You know why? Really? Because these people are unhappy. A lot of them are unhappy being really? in your cult. And they would like met? to leave. And imagine, you How know what? Why do you, why are you security guard? Why How do they, what, why do you How need security? You why do you need security? Why do you need security? How many have you met? Why does Scientology need security? To make sure they don't run off. You're here to make sure they don't run off. You make sure that they get on the bus. You it's know called exactly goo. Why. It's not goody. It's goo. It's goo. Mr. Goo? goo? There you, you know go. know exactly why. There you There's go. security here. Exactly why. Right. To make sure they don't We're run off. We're in Hollywood Boulevard. To make sure they don't run off. We're in Hollywood Boulevard. To make Boulevard. sure they don't run What's off. What's the crime rate? To make sure they the don't run off. Rate? To make sure that... What, What's the, the crime rate? Scientology, Scientology What's the crime, crime rate, rate Hollywood? is very you high. You know that. You know that. Danny Masterson? Danny Masterson? What's the crime rate What's the crime rate of Danny Masterson, huh? Who do you... Let's talk about the child trafficking, the, the human trafficking. It's super high and because of Scientology. This is not a rascal. You're in my face. You're touching me. You I'm literally not. put your hands I'm on my camera. I'm moving away, and you're moving forward. I've been here. I've so been in the same no spot problem. the whole time. Now let's talk about the crime rate in, in Hollywood. Let's go down let's here. Let's talk about the Scientology let's crime Let's go down here. Right, because you don't want me to look at these guys going on a bus. You want to sit there and hide them going on a bus. Why do you want to hide them? It's harassment. What are you going to do about it? What are you gonna do about it? It's harassment. It's called, well, it's subjective, because I call it a first amendment. I call it informative. You call it harassment. 
difference is taking, the truth is on my basin. side. The truth is on my it's side. Not truth, though. The truth is on my it's side. Not truth. Well, you know what? It's not truth. What's take? I'm going to let Scientology. people see what it's you've like. Never a day in the life. You never. When these people, it. I'm. A, they're going to experience it right now. We're going to show. You them. have never experienced. I don't care. Who would want to? Who would want to? Who would want to? With your billion dollar contract. Go do something else. Do me a favor. Stop stepping forward. Step out of my space. Take a step back. Do not step forward again. If you step forward into my space again, I will take that as an act of aggression. Do you understand me? I call him Officer Fun Time because whenever he's on camera is when it's the most fun time. You're on camera. Well, I'm on, you you're on camera. You do you're being live streamed. I told I'm you, do not take a, another I'm step toward me. Now you see where it is. Do not take another step sidewalk. toward me. Do not stand come in my space. Sidewalk. Exactly. Like as I am. And you know what? I'm going to get a you good look. And you know what I'm going to do? Every person that comes through here, I'm going to give them a chance to talk to their family. But nobody is, as they go on a bus. talking to anybody. Oh, oh, did but you. you. Wait, wait, wait. Are you. you? Are you telling me that they will not? Are you telling me that? You're deciding for them. No, I'm not. Okay, but we're going to let them decide. It's a public sidewalk and it's a freedom of speech, right? There you go, big guy. There it's you go. Big Look at them wobbling. Look at them. Oh, this guy's hiding. You can walk. You can jog. Uh, mind your bus. Mind your, I run marathons. You can jog, man. So what, you insult me because I walk? Uh, you just said, you, you know, the thing is, my guy. You, you don't even my, Get out of my face. I told it. you to get out of my face. Do I'm not do it. Sidewalk, I take dude. that as a sign of it. If you come into sidewalk. my space. Right. I'm and on I'm sidewalk. on a sidewalk. But if you come into my you're space. Being filmed. Mind your business. And you're being so filmed. Go somewhere else. You're being my. No. Go a, somewhere else. It's a public sidewalk, like you said, right? And now, the thrilling conclusion. There you I'm go, talking to genius. You, you're That's why you're a security. You are a, like 50, 60 years old as, sci as a security guard for a Scientology. Now look at them. They're leaving to go around the block. Everybody's delayed because of you. Look at them going back there. Everybody's delayed because of you. Definitely, it's your. That's yeah, blah, blah, blah. That's why you're. You are a security guard, buddy. Mind your business. Mind your business. Good. I told you it's not goody. It's good. You're gonna say my name. You say my name right. Like nobody knows my name. Like I'm not a activist out here like i'm not the number one lapd critic out here you wouldn't know you're locked in a cult you wouldn't even know the cult is scientology the thing that you're in look at you you signed a billion year contract and you're saying it's not a cult it's not a cult you signed a billion year contract it's not a cult, not a cult. are you gonna step in my space again are you gonna are you going to are you going to wobble into my space again I can do whatever the hell I want. Oh, okay. There you go. So can I. Remember that goes both ways, buddy. Yes, you can, remember man. it goes both ways. But remember something? I'm going to tell you right now. Actually, if you're Trump, I'm going to end your religion. Your religion is going to end because of me. I'm going to end you guys. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Look at that face. Look at that. Goofy. I told you I'm going to end your religion. Billion year oh wow, they're gonna walk down the block, guys. So remember, I told you I'm a marathon runner, right? Bye, see you later. Look at them. If you guys want help out, I'll help you out. You know you don't like this life. Don't you miss your families? Don't you miss your families? You miss your families, don't you? Look at them. Look at these guys. Scientologists, they're cold. You see it? Look at them. They're cold. They can't talk to their family. The security guard won't let them talk to their families. This security guard, this guy, what are you from France? Up, uh, up. Uh. Sidewalk. Look, he's trying to block me from getting on the sidewalk. Look at this. You are so goofy. I saw a poster of you written in French. I found it on facial recognition. If you want me to reach out to your families, I will. There are better things in life than this. There are better things in life than this. It's a good look for you guys. Imagine being a religion where you have to be so secretive and prevent, prevent. They're not really doing anything to me. They just don't want them speaking. They've been hijacked. You should be ashamed of yourself. Yeah, you have a great one. You have a great one. Religion. Acts like that. What kind of religion? And so like, you know, they, honestly, they think they're gonna intimidate me 
which is really goofy because they're the least intimidating thing. Like I said, I do a couple things in this town. I'm a cop watcher. Probably the LAPD's one of the top critics of the LAPD. I'm also a government accountability activist. I go after the mayor. I go after city council for the wasteful spending, for the ineffective policies, and for the outright corruption. And it's an enormous amount of corruption, all of them, Karen Bass, the entire city council. I believe in just standing up for what's right. And I don't think what they're doing is right. And nobody stands up to them. Everybody's scared of them because of a perception of harassment. But like I said, they're a paper tiger. What they're used to doing is running to the LAPD, have a great relationship back under Captain Palka, who did his best to protect Scientology, but also Les Moonves of, was it CBS? Their specialty back then was covering up, covering up sexual assaults. So they've had a relationship with them, and Scientology usually has LAPD PD do their dirty work. They hire off-duty LAPD to do an investigative work, which is actually against LAPD policy to work as a private investigator. But then they also hire ex-LAPD to investigate all their victims, like Danny Masterson's victims. Somehow, Danny Masterson, his attorney, oh, you get out of my face. You, you think you're scaring somebody goofy? You think you're really gonna scare somebody goofy? Walk toward me and swerve, swerve. That's right, you better get out of my way. You're kidding me. Yeah. Shut, oh, shut your mouth, shut your mouth. Sidewalk, and, and then again, Boulevard. and you're not scaring and anybody. Hollywood what is that little flashlight? You're not scaring and anybody. If you learn nothing else from this channel, at least understand that insulting the people who make your food is one of the worst ideas ever. I don't give a f about your attitude. What do I order? <laughs> oh yeah, you don't know because you don't know how to do your job? Oh man, imagine that. Man, we got a lot of people waiting up here because you can't f make the goddamn order right. I'm <laughs> either. A McChicken, please! <laughs> I don't give a f about your attitude! <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Okay? Hey, McChicken, stop trying to overtalk me, hey, McChicken. Hey, McChicken. Hey, McChicken. Hey, McChicken. Okay, it doesn't matter how much you try to overtalk me on your little piece of headset. Hey, McChicken. Oh my God. Right now because you have the best attitude ever. Does... does she realize she's on camera saying all this? He's changing the locks right now, by the way. He's doing that right now, so... If you were to leave out today, I don't know. Mm hmm. Not to be done, and you know what? You haul storage on Mass Ave. That's where it'll be, and I'll pay for it. You're not gonna touch my stuff. Oh... I already got people coming. I already got people coming. Believe it, because you can't lock that, huh? Well, I'm gonna go to work Believe later, it. so... Well, good. Good, 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 good. Just don't touch my stuff. Good. I promise you, on Jesus Christ, your sh will be out of here tomorrow. And you're playing with the I'm letting you know that right now. Like I said, all that will be gone, locks changed, and I'll say I never knew you. And the thing on the thing is not even mine. <laughs> it's not even mine, it's fake. <laughs> what are you talking about? What's fake? <laughs> I got you. Hey, What's fake? It's raw. It ain't even mine. Mm. What's fake? Mm. 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 I know what I be doing. That's wrong. What's fake? <laughs> it ain't even mine. <laughs> your signature? Yeah. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I know what I be doing, yo. I know the game. It's not even mine. Look at it. Go look at it. Go look at it. <laughs> Cause it's your lights. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not gonna even let it out. But it's not even mine. It ain't even mine. It ain't even mine. Ain't no mail came here. You got to prove it. You got to prove it. You got to prove it. But you can't. Okay? So therefore, bye bye Bye-bye. Bye -bye. And so now, this time tomorrow, you'll be gone, and I'll be at peace. You done? You wouldn't be popping all this. I gotta go. You done? You wouldn't be popping all this. Walk out that door. I bet you when he's done, you won't be able to get back in. You'll have to ring that doorbell. And you know what? I plead the fifth. I don't know who that is.
<laughs> you know what? <laughs> I know how to do it. Believe that. Uh, you know. You so know. can you just confirm, since you're a tough guy, can you just confirm that's what's wrong? Yours? That's wrong. What was fake? That's wrong. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Well, so now you shut up because the camera's I don't going. Know, I don't know what you're talking about. You say what's fake. I don't know what you're talking about. You're a f Yeah, that's fake. Go look at it. Go look at it. Go look at it. Go look at it. It's wrong. So, you have no grounds, buddy boy. You're weird. Yeah, you got issues. Yeah. Yeah. Go ahead. <laughs> yeah. No, we're... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Be careful. You <laughs> uh, so you get it now? Uh, uh, you got played. <laughs> uh, you got played. <laughs> That's why he left, because he knew he got played. You got played too. You are a disgrace. And right now when you close the door, your silent thoughts, you're so sad inside. You are. You're sad inside. You really are. I feel bad for you. I know when you close the door, you'll probably cry. You'll probably go back into your little and get sad again. Yeah, yeah, you will. You will. Have your fun now. But when that door closed, we know what psychological problems go on. We know you go into your deep thoughts. We know you do that. We know. I know that. I've been in the medical field long enough to know. When that door closed, you're a very sad soul. A very lonely soul. I know that. I can see it. I can tell by looking in your eyes. You're dead inside your eyes. There's no life. There's no happiness. There's no nothing. You don't even have a girlfriend. If you did, you'd go live with her. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. You really should. You got your little job now. No, you don't. You're not working. You're not working. You're a liar. I don't believe nothing you say. Everything you say is a lie. But I tell you what, the locks will be changed tomorrow. Oh, but it doesn't end there. What? Did you turn this heat on? I can't hear you. What did you say? Did you turn the heat on? Is there a problem? No. Did you turn the heat on? I'm asking if there's a problem. Yeah, there's a problem. The heat's on. Okay. Did you turn? I'm asking you. Did you turn it on? I'm a little cold. Well, you know what? I have nothing to do with that. Don't touch my heat. No, it's my heat. I live here. Look, goddamn it! You know what? Open this. Don't touch my heat. Why are you banging on my door? Look, Yup. Then stop touching my shit. I got nothing to do with your shit. Away from my door. Or what? You ain't paying no bills here. What's gonna happen if I do? Like I said. You threatening me? See, I was gonna let the little bastard stay a little longer. You know what? You, you know what? Let me call John right now. You don't turn my fing heat on and nobody but in your fing room. You, and someone's always going there doing something. You did. Let me call John. You stole my gift card. Why the fing I do some petty like that? Because you're you a petty. I pay all the bills. You pay all the bills? Yeah, I see you know what it is? I'm gonna show you something. I'm gonna show you something right now. You threatening me? I'm show uh, yeah, I'm show you I'm showing you something right now. Oh, so you're threatening me. I'm showing you something right now. So you know what you think you're gonna try to do? You're gonna try to stay here, but I'm gonna promise you something on my life. You leaving out of here tomorrow. We'll see. I don't appreciate that word. You don't call me that slur, please. You heard what I Please don't call me that word again. Twin, throw my backpack in my case. I'm going to the police station. I'm getting a restraining order. I'm saying I'm afraid of my life. Good luck. He don't know how much power I got. Yep. Land Lord Almighty. You want to be ashamed of yourself. I look down on people like you. You see the bottom of my shoe? That's where you belong. And I step on people like you. Thank and you. your whole family are all rats. Thank you. Because look at the little product that I'm going to fall to. Thank you. Uh, please. Thank you. You don't need help. I beg you. <laughs> <laughs> you need to be stop. shattered. Just stop. You need to be in the shattered. Just stop. You know what? If you were my kid, you wouldn't do it. be the abortion that lived. Oh. I would have aborted your Because you know what? You crazy. I'm glad you and the constable get here. You are not going to say that. Yeah, and you're probably friends with him too. I am. I fucked him. So what if I did? He's a constable. 
He ain't gonna break the rules for me. That's one thing they're not gonna lose their job over me. Who Three months said? probation? Yeah. There's no yeah. such thing. It's yeah. It's what I do. It's my it's my rules and I wouldn't want to